would you say that you knew you were going to take the back way into Europe? Now, Nim say, Uberfa back way, Ako Europe. The back way can be determined by uh, those who know the pr proper way. What you've grown up to know is that you use the route to Europe to make life. Because when you are living, the family go and pray for you, and when you come back, they will go and thank God. Me, Martin Shre. Me, Martin Shre. Do swear that. Me can't tell say. Me can't tell say. I'll speak the truth. Me cannot cry. Me cannot cry. The whole truth. No cry ni na. No cry ni na. And nothing but the truth. Enye bibi a fa no cry no ho. Enye no bibi a can no cry ho. So help me God. Nyame mwa me. Nyame mwa me. Thank you. Mr. Kerry, welcome to the Gambia. Mr. Tre, Akwaba, Aba Gambia. Yeah, mom. Thank you. Uh, the interpreter, you should, I'm um, sorry, we're giving you the enormous responsibility of interpreting both ways, from English into Twi and from Twi into English. We are here. We've understood. Do you understand? Yes, yes sir. We've understood. Uh, before you start interpreting, could you kindly take an oath that you would interpret from English into Twi and from Twi into English to the best of your ability. I, Kwesi Brako, do swear that I will interpret. I will interpret from from Twi to English and English to Twi to the best of my knowledge and ability. To the best of my knowledge and ability. So help me God. So help me God. Uh, Mr. Kerry, welcome to the Gambia. Mr. Tre Akwaba, Eba Gambia. Also, yeah, mom. Thank you very much. Uh, we regret very much that you are coming back to this country under the current circumstances. You know, I see it as an opportunity because of all of us, our well-being. Uh, we do hope that uh, you have had a good reception into this country and that uh, you are being taken care of. You want to say, Oba Kruwe, we are sure to see a mau in India as a soon. Anyaji se Moha Nansono and Yeah Rusi Nemum Menajidia Menamogambi ha mini remuchi sanse miniso bea di machi or beme bonibia. I'm very happy to be here though I'm sorry lie on you people. Um thank you very much. Uh of course uh, you are aware that you are uh, asked to appear before this truth commission. Uh, to talk about uh, the migrants that came to the Gambia in 2005. Yes, I know the, that is the reasons why I'm here. Good. You have just made an oath to speak the truth and nothing but the truth. What you say, Obeka no kre, inge bibia se no kre. Sankutu ena masuwe se meka no kre mkwa. Exactly, that is what I am going to say. If you want, you can speak in English. It would be interpreted into Twi for those who are listening, perhaps in Ghana, or those who are Ghanaians in Gambia who who are listening. If you wish, you may also speak in Twi, and it would be interpreted in the English language. The choice is yours. Feel free to decide the language in which you would wish to speak. Mr. Chair, who am I going to say? Oka kase biya ope. Se biya wamo omo wo amanoni a omo suye gana fu obi timi ati ni oka nase. Inti se obi timi akano obrofu mu se obi timi akano otwi mu no. Feel free na timi kan na ni ope se oka. Yen show. Ope se. I want to speak in English so that 
it will be interpreted in three languages so so those in ghana will understood, will ah, understood thank you very much so now you would switch to to the english language and then we would have interpretation in uh, from english into twi sisi ano beka no brofu mo ne nya entretre no from brofu mo eko twi mo but that's it but even though you're going to speak in english you have to wait for my questions to be interpreted first from english into twi and then you respond se obeka no brofu mo no ese so twen na me me questions e be bisa no ye dano no ko twi mo e ma o ansa na obeje so uh, we should I, I also, have heard you. We should also exercise some discipline to ensure that the speeches do not overlap. Because if the speeches do overlap, there would be a problem for the for the transcribers and the interpreters as well. Ati se mekanik makun makun se be ya ubi abitimi ati asini ya meku pese mekan asin. I will say it one after the other so that it will be understood to those who are listening. Uh, thank you very much. Thank you. Um, what are your full names? Udin Nanidin. My full name is Martin Kwajuchre. Could you spell the last name for us please ubetimi akan udino ni edito no ubetimi abu ni dino k y e r e and how do you pronounce that and u pronounce ne sen obo ni dino sen chire we pronounce it i pronounce it chire chire that's right all right yeah uh, i ask this uh, because we have a list of victims that was written phonetically maybe and the way some names are spelled and the way they are pronounced may be somewhat different maybe sir if we say woman no mo kan ho no wo mo dinu se ne ya tro tro no no e ma wo mo bo dinu e so no se ne ya tro no no nti na o poso hu ne se ne o bo dinu fo se fa yes so the at at some stage we would have to visit the list we have in order for you to assist us in the spelling of some of these names. Edru Bebia, Yebebo, Edino, no what me abo, Asene, Edino, Sene, Ebo, Dino. Thank you, Councilman. Okay, Martin Tre, what's your date of birth? Martin Tre, Yewo, Dabeng. 3rd March, 1980. Hmm. And where were you born? Ehini, Ewo, Ewo. Brekum at Bono region in Ghana. And uh, what is your profession? Um, I am a trader, a shoe seller. Could we have that? Oh, could we have that interpreted in two? Me, 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 Thank you very much. And uh, do you recall where you were in early in July of 2005? Okay, baby, I now July 2005. I remember where I was July 2005. Okay, baby, I now July 2005. Did you have cause to leave Ghana in July of 2005? Na somewhere there about? Na Ghana At July 2005, I was not in Ghana, but rather I am. I was in Senegal. July, July 2005. No, I'm in Ghana. I'm in Senegal. When did you leave Ghana to go to Senegal? Dabe na ufri Ghana eko Senegal. I left Ghana. Early 2005, uh, January. Be free Ghana, 2005, January. And where were you going? Ahina na oko. Intention is going to seek greener pasture, going to Europe. 
na majin nyina ne se me ko europe as at the time you left ghana in january 2005 did you have an idea where you were going to go in order to get the you the chance to go to europe samre na o free ghana 2005 now ni baby a wo be fa akọ baby a wo ko no yes i know the time i left ghana i know that definitely that i'm going to senegal so i was able to get to senegal 2005 ane na me nim se e bi ame ko no me free ghana no na me ko senegal until no 2005 and i made through senegal why senegal i didn't now call senegal senegal because in our place people used to uh, pass senegal to kivet and later get to europe so as initial stage when you are growing up you hear it people talk about it so you have knowledge where it's close to europe and where people used to uh, have access to europe so it's not something new to a young guy who is growing up in our area na ye ho no se wo nyine a na nkrofo ka se wo dru senegal dia e ben europe enti no na e ya dia me dia hye ma dwen achi enti na e ma me tu sa kwa no in a sense growing up in your area you knew of a route that people would take to get them to europe and that route passes through senegal unyine na muwo adwem po bi se ubeko europe a ubefa be bi a ekwan no eda senegal yes i know because some people has been used that way to europe and they have been back to our place so they used to talk to other peoples so uh even women also have knowledge because when they come back they speak to everyone this is the way i use so if any young one or any child who is growing up is interested in going to europe he can also uh have that way to get to europe and krofo akohaba na omo ba na omo ba mane e se ampa e ho na e fa e ko europe entino na e ya de a enya de foforo kra entino ye ho no de nipa ni nyina nkwala no bebre wo mu nim se e ho na ofa wo be ko europe is there a name by which this route is known commonly it didn't be what what sir kwan we so obi any more now okay specifically there is no name but senegal is not the only way that we use so whenever somebody is embarking on such journey he normally said i'm using desert or i'm going by sea so some sometimes they say if there is no land we go by sea so that is where that that is some ways they used to ginger the young ones up so that you grown up to that when you get to a place where there is no land you go by sea ye ni edin bia ye de ma no na emom no de etia ni se enye senegal nko eni oman aye fa mu e ma be bre na enya ya ye se ye be fa stress so enti no enya eye nyine no na e ya de aye de she ya dwen achi in this country it is described as the back way from hano ye ka sa sem no se back way yes is the later on i heard that word that word but in ghana we don't have that word but when you speak that definitely the people have understanding of what you are talking about ane gana die na ye nimsa e kire ya ansa na ye hunu se be bi ye fre no back way in fact back way illegal migration both describe the type of uh journeys that you also talk about correct back way any illegal migration ni na e tre akonya wo tre tre mu atro bia no meboa eno ano no exactly that that that's that's the correct that's the correct one oh sorry exactly. thank you very much sanity mm -hmm. so when you left ghana 
to Senegal in January of 2005, you intended to take an illegal route to Europe. Is that it? Free Ghana 2005. No, never say, Senegal, Europe. And now we need a and they are illegal. And I'm a boy. Yes, the time I'm leaving Ghana, I know where I'm going. I know that I'm taking a route to Senegal and uh, take on the Mediterranean Sea to Europe. I know where I'm going, but consider it as an illegal. That is the question. Na minim se me kwa me faho na me drew Senegal na me timia ko Europe na se na ye ajim boni ana se kwa boni seno di e no di e asimbisa. Would you say that you knew you were going to take the back way into Europe? Na unim se ubefa back way ako Europe. Sometimes. The back way can be determined by uh, those who know the pr proper way. Because what you've grown up to know is that you use the route to Europe. So the one who you have fought in his hands may determine whether you are passing back way or but The one who is embarking on such journey is considered it as a hard call to make life. Because when you are living, the family go and pray for you, and when you come back, they will go and thank God. So they think it's the greatest opportunity in life. Now, our name say, eh, akwenya say, obefaho say, oh, kas pope say, oh, kwa, eh, wabushi afono, omo bompa yemo. In essence, for you, your objective was just to get to Europe through Senegal, and it did not matter how you do it, whether it was legal or illegal, all your, your objective was just to get there, correct? Now what do you say, would you who first in the girl, Eddie, I call Europe, say Papa, say Bonnie, would you now what dream up and say, oh, for now, would you I call? Yes. Anne. So, yes, but at that time, we don't know much about illegal, illegalities concerning that because we consider it as illegal when you don't have papers with you. If you don't have any identification with you, you become an illegal because you are you become very difficult to be uh, access you or to locate or to find who you are. But so far as you are living in West Africa, moving from country to country, and you have your ID card with you, we can't we don't consider traveling from Ghana to Mali to uh, Kidra to uh, whatever to Dakar. Journey is not an illegal because you have your documents with you to Dakar. Na inimse enye kwambo no neso de enimse enam kwambo neso no se wo kwa na e bia woni ngrata bia e wo ho. You are perfectly right. Uh, there is free movement of peoples or persons and goods in West Africa. So as a Gambian, I could travel all the way in West Africa uh, and it would not be illegal. Yes. As for as long as I have my papers, and the same would apply to every other West African. Same woman, cry, thank you, and dear, meet me at Kobe Bia. A travel, a crowful fly, West African crony, and also. But I was referring to the leg from Senegal to Europe. But me, Bisa say free Senegal, Eco Europe, no. And no matter me, Bisa. That leg would have been illegal if the person did not have the necessary authorizations to go to that country. Asa, a queen and no name, Patrice, say, Ubi Faho, Nasa, or the Co Europa, and then a trace, oh, he had no crata, a man who can say, Oh, free Senegal, a Co Europe, and who has some name, Bisa. For that one, counsel, I agree. Major Tom. Good. Uh, when you are going to Senegal, did you have an idea or did you have contacts in Senegal? Uh, who would receive you when you got there? 
uko Senegal no na unim obi a ah, unim obi a unim se uko sue no so ana no council because uh the way we we prepare ourselves to embark on such journey we know that wherever you go in every country you go and meet Ghanaian. so and exactly when you get to your station you will breathe before you take off from your country that whenever you go to any country you should ask for where Ghanaians are and when you get to them they will locate where your brother is definitely you have somebody that come from close to your village maybe from the, the same town or some that's the way we prepare ourselves we did not necessarily know someone there before we start back on such thing so in fact sorry yeah kono ye ni bibia sa na ye adwene se ye kwa ye be hu gana ni wo ho ne akwa kosue no in fact when you were going you knew your destination was senegal senegal and you knew that when you arrive there you must find ghanaians who would help you out uko na nawo ni mi se uko senegal na na wo adwu mu se uko obekwa ko hu gana ni a obeboa wo and so that's the case for my case when i'm coming to dakar i came with one nigerian so we reached dakar early in the morning so i slept with him at baba shop so next day morning he sent me to a one on story building where Ghanaians are living so he say this is your brothers so i go straight to them and they receive me ane council the attorney say yeah ba no me ba no me ni nigeria ni bi na ba e ndi e ko e na obi a ba bi o mu yi tri e na o mu ji yen uh, how did you come to meet that Nigerian? She then was she a Nigerian, you know. At at uh, Kid, Kid, Kidira, I met him at Kidira on my way to uh, uh, Senegal. So um, we met at the Kidira border town. He also coming to Senegal with his wife. Michiano or Kidira, na ono so eko Senegal. And Kidira is in which country? Na Kidira no eko Krobenso. Kidira no e. Mali and Senegal border. Eh, Mali and Senegal, she also. The border between Senegal and Mali, that's where we call Kidra. Yes. Good. And when you arrive in Dakar, Senegal, where exactly, do you recall exactly where you went? Who drew Dakar, Senegal, no, okay, baby, pot, senior, okay. Yes, Medina, and the house number I recall was. Retrantroa and the current. Retrantroa. Retrantroa. R U E Trantroa and the current. Angle current. Yes. Retrantroa angle current in Medina. Yes. Okay. Okay. So, what happened when you arrived there? In two hundred and ten is here. One afternoon. We were sitting at uh, in, the, in the front of our house, and we found a three guys approaching where we live. In fact, they are Ghanaians, and they came with one tall black guy with big eye. So the guy came and they greet us, and uh, we give them a place to sit. Um, uh, you crumble for Ghana for and you know all my your mama baby and I'm not trying did you know them before no any mom and Sana no what did they say when those three guys accompanied with another tall black black person arrived what what happened grow for me and Sana by now only a quarter center by no and then you see they came with uh, message that this man name is called Chastila and he's a vessel captain and he have a vessel that he want to send people to Europe na nipa no abaye no asimo mukan ni say akwa tintin your friend Chastila na owo eh hema a etimede nipa ko Europe and this person who called himself Charles Taylor did he say which country he was from? Na akoyan o si e furniture still lay o katre o e crow free so dey. Yes. He said he is American and in fact he have an American passport in his hand. 
ane osi oya American ni na America passport kutano. Were you able to speak to him? Uti mene ne kasae. Yes, I speak to him several times. Ane mene ne kasae mprebebri. In which language? Awo kasa bimu. English. Mene ne kabrofo. As a Ghanaian, were you able to detect from Charles Taylor's accent whether he was truly American? So we are Ghana nino. Uti mi huo Charles Taylor kasa amose ufri America. Yes, like uh, the way he speak and he back it on his passport also. And uh, I was not the only person who knows him. In fact, he. He was introduced to me by those who are close to him and those who know where he lived. Ane, if you say, eh, or they nekra touch rebe, ena ankro fonzu swa no omo ene ne ba ya no anaso omo nimno no omo so kasa. And uh, when you heard from this Charles Taylor that uh, he ha he was the captain of a vessel, uh, what happened next? Uti sa cha stela we inka ah yeka se ono na oye captain ewo shemano suno edeni si. Cha stela decide to collect money from anyone who want to embark on such journey. So he always came to Medina with some three guys to find out if he can have money from any passenger who is interested to embark on such journey. Do you recall who introduced you to this Charles Taylor? Yes, Charles Taylor came to our place with Asian. What's his what's Asian's full name? Oh. Surely I'll give you within but the Asian is what normally in my mind but after the testimony i can record and add it to you asian and other guy because of time i just forget him but it's asian and other guys who came and introduced chastila to us in our place in medina i have a copy of your statement with me and i will just throw out names to help refresh your memory me wo onkrata efa wo adanse die hu na metimi abobo edin na ewo mu no amawo Does the no name Robert bring a bell? Na edin no Robert no. Yeah. What is that? Robert Asian. Yes. Because the name Robert Asian was not the name that we used to call him because he's a tall guy. We call him Tola Tola. Mm -hmm. So his name cannot be remembered frequently. So that's why I was able to have only the ACN. Now, your friend of ACN, now Robert ACN, now just say near or or one tiny friend of Tola Tola and T. Nya dia na me meet me a kai ni dino. So we we take it that the person you referring to is Robert, Robert ACN, aka Tola Tola. Intine ya jitu mi se ni pana awo kana semno. Ono ni ya friend of Robert ACN, ana mufta ya friend of Tola Tola. So you you also indicate uh, that there was another person who introduced you to Robert. Usan tre se na obi fu fronso o wa or introduce you ma sa Robert we. No, the Robert ACN and other guy came with Charles Taylor to Medina. So they came to introduce Charles Taylor to us at Medina. Now Eh, nipa na oka hono oni Robert na eba ye no mo edi chasti la chere ye. Do you know a person called Victor? Unu mo be friend of Victor. Yes, I know Victor Odru. Yes, he also was a close guy to Asian and uh, also captain. So normally they all move together. Ane, ano so so no eh ye. Eh, obia oka hemani binti no tembi ano ne captain no ene namu. So this person, Robert Essien and Charles Taylor, 
when they came to meet you, did they come with Victor Oduru? Inti sani pa wei aye fene robete sieno, oni chaste la baye no, na Victor Oduru ko omu hwa na anebe hwa. Yes, na Victor Oduru e ka omu hwa, na Victor Oduru no, na onti dia pli, he did not live at dia place, Victor Oduro did not live with Tola and uh, uh, Captain Chastila. He lived at Medina. But the time they approached our place, they came with Victor Oduro and Robert Isin. Yes, Victor Oduro was among them. Now, Emre Amobaya no die. Now, ono onkaho. So when you met these guys, Charles Taylor in, was introduced to you as someone who could who was a captain of a boat and could assist to take you to Europe. Uh, what decisions did you make? In this, who was an crofo way I catch or say, Chastella no bit me a ball and walk to Europe no. I dream be na ufaye. We first sent people to go to Senegal port to verify if indeed he have a vessel at the Senegal port. So, Tola and. Uh, Victor, they came and say yes, indeed, the man have a vessel at the Senegal port. I'm a bass, I know your man crow for a course. I'm a coffee, say no cry now. And now, Tola, name Victor, or more coin, or more by Messiani, or more him up. And then what happened after that? And I didn't see So before, after the confirmation. The man continued to ask money from the passengers who are interested to embark on such journey. But because the situation in Senegal, some money has been collected from many passengers. They send them to the high seas and they return them back and say the weather is no good. We can't proceed. It has been continued for a long time. So no one was ready at that time to give money to Chastila. Na chese, a drew maybe a jiu musika sa omu ko drew a punim fin fi omu si o a swachi ne bodo do no masaya ba entino ubia a nye krado se odis kabe mano. And as a result, Chastila said he have a friend in Gambia whose name is called Lamin Tunkara. So he will go to Gambia and see that man. Na. Eh, openi no eka se o Adam Fobi chasi la kaso o Adam Fobi a o Gambia o friend o Lamie Tunkara entino oba bihuno. So after some days, Tola and Victor communicate to us that Chastila have given them information that Lamie Tunkara promised to give him money. But before he will give him money, he must to return the vessel from uh, Senegal waters to Gambia because he also has some passengers here so that he can join uh, with his passengers. And you know, Eba Sano, the Okayane say, Lame Tunka Rano, Chastila say, this year, the Hemanoba, Gambia, and Sana, Yetimi, Enya, Enya Ska. So the passengers who are living in Senegal should find a place called, uh, the place that's secure so that we can have a big size of canoe so that we can use to join the vessel at the waters. Which waters? Say Gambia waters. Gambia, Eposo. So, we gathered ourselves at Sali around Mbu district. And uh, we are many people there. I think. How, how many of you? At that initial stage, we are over 50 at the Bara, at, at the Mbu Sali. But did you, do you have a definitive figure? But oh, number, particular number, wait me a No, because I am not the conveyor. Uh, I saw Robert Isian counting the people after they brought the canoe from uh, Mbu. 
and the canoe came with a lot of people including nigerians and uh, other guys who have never met before so uh exact number later uh, i found about 67 that was uh, uh robert asian later on because he was the one who made the counting robert asian actually no crowd catch him say omo ye eduesia nso of that 67 Sir, Edio Sainzion. How many people did you know? I, know. I can't give you exact figure and that exact people that I know, but it's not everybody that I know. They will not pass half because not everybody I know. It's the small people that came from our place, our village, and our district. That's the people uh, I've come to contact before. Uh, yes, uh, just tell us those who you can remember. That is, that is good okay. Yes. One by one. Uh -huh. I remember Abari Kasim Osama. Abari? Abari Kasim. How do you spell Abari? A B A R I. Uh huh. Kasim. A A S S I M. Yes, Kasim. Okay. Uh -huh. We have. Kabari Kasim from where? From Ghana. Mm -hmm. We have Eric Yao. Mm -hmm. Eric have, Yao. Yao is Y A O. Yes. O, yeah? We have uh, Victor Ousu. Y A O O O Y A W O. Y A O. Yao. Okay. Okay. And then three? We have uh, Victor Udru. Victor Oduru, O D U R R O. Yes, O O D U R U. O D U R O. Okay. All right. Proceed. We have Edmond Kume. E D M O O O M U. We have Richmond Adey. Uh, Edmond. Edmond. O e D M M O N. Edmond. Okay. O N D. Edmond what? Kumi. Kumi K U M I. We have Kwabena Fusu. Okay. Five. Kwabna K W A B E N A. Kwabna, huh? Yes, we have Kwabna Kwa Fusu. Yes, Kwabna Fusu. Mm -hmm. We have Richard Boachi. Could you take Richard Boachi? Richard Boachi, how do you spell that? B O A uh -huh. K Y E. Boachi, okay. Yes. Seven. Mm -hmm. We have uh, Yao Chire. Y A O. Yao, yes, Yao Chire. K Y E R E. That's right. Mm -hmm. uh, we have uh, mm, we have Janet. Yes, we call Ivar Ivar from Cote d'Ivoire. Janet. Janet. The only name my name is Janet. From Cote d'Ivoire. Yes. Uh huh. We have Maku. Maku. Uh, Maku. It's male or female? Female. Maku. Yes. And uh, what's her last name? I think the. Because it's the only Maku that I know at that time. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, yes. We have Maku. Uh, uh, what? Where was she from? He's a. She's oh, a Ghanaian. Free. She's a Ghanaian Maku. Ghanaian. Okay. Yes. Female Ghanaian. Female Ghanaian. Mm -hmm. We have Eja Amo. Spell Eja Amo. How do you spell Eja? A G Y A. A G Y A. Okay, Eja Amo. Amo. Okay, A Amo. How do you spell that? A M M O. Okay. We have Eric Ngetia. Eric Ngetia. Yes. Uh, we have uh, Ngetia N G E T H I A. Oh, N, uh, N K E. N K. N K E. Yes. We have okay. Eric Ngetia. Okay. Uh, we have. Uh, Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Kwabana Fusu. Yes, you did mention I Kwabana, mentioned Kwabana Fusu. Fusu. Edmond Kume, we have Yachre, we have uh there is some guys we used to call them other names. So their real names become very difficult to remember. Then we have someone called Queer Master. His his name was around but just a guy named always Queer Master. Queer Master, yes. He's from his name was David. 
I just forget. So uh, now. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you've given a statement before. We didn't care. I can't watch him do that. So. In your statement, you have included names like Ena, wa Enoch, no no. Enoch Kwame Amo. That is a jamo. O, o oh, that's a jamo. That's right. Enoch Ejamo. Okay. So, so, what is the name? Is it Aja Amo or Enoch Kwame Amo? We used to call him Aja Amo, but the name Enoch is okay. what the family provided in attached to his name. Okay. All right. All right, and uh, you've also provided uh, Ajikum. Yes, Ajikum was a mom. So we should add that. That would Ajikum. be thirteen. Huh? Ajikum. Yes. Huh? Yes. You've also provided uh, Kusi. Kwabna Kusi. What? Did, what? Could you say that again? Kwabna Kusi. Kwabna Kusi. Not Kwabna Fosi. Fosi. We have Kwabna Fosu and we have Kwabna Kusi. Okay. That would be 14, Kwabna, Kwabna Usi. Hmm? Yes. Daniel Amamkwa? Daniel Amamkwa. Hmm? Yes. That's taken from your statement. Just hold a second. Okay. Uh, you've also provided... Uh, Kwadu Ampadu. Kwadu, yes, Ampadu. Mm -hmm. That's Ghanaian also? Yes, he's a Ghanaian. He's a Ghanaian. Daniel Kwadu Bai? Yes. Do you remember that name? Kaisadino. Yes, I remember. Bai. Anime Kaisadino. You remember any other name? Okay, I didn't for Bia. Oh, I think when I remember any name, I'll just give it to your council. So, Mikai, I didn't be a Mekashro. So, essentially, you've given me 17 names for now. Yes. Barry Kasim, Eric Yao, Victor Oduru. Uh, we are forgetting you, Richard, Richard Chere, <laughs> Martin Martin Chieri. Yes. Uh, Okay, that is 18. Uh, so, Abari Kasim, Eric Yao, Victor Oduru, Edmond Kumi, Kwab Nafosu, Richard Baki, Yao Chieri, Janet from Côte d'Ivoire, Maku from Ghana, uh, Enoch Kwami Amo, who is Ajamo, Eric Nketia, uh, Kwe Master, uh, Ajekum, Kwabna Kusi, Daniel Amankwa, Kwadu Ampadu, Daniel Kwadu Bai, and your humble self. Martin Richmond Chere. Ade. Who? Richmond Ade. 19, Richmond Ade. Yes. How do you spell the Ade? A-D-D-E-A. A-D-D-E-A. E-A. That's right. Okay. Good. These are the people you could recall. For now, for now, for now, this is the names that is on my fingertips that I can. How about Eric Nana? Now Eric Nana, sorry. No, we have Eric Yao. Okay, in your statement you said. Eric, Eric Nana Yao also answer. Yes. I mean, Nana is a title. He, he can take it out of it. And so we have Eric Yao. So, oh, so, okay. So that's Eric Yao. That's all. All right. Good. So this group, you claim that Eric counted them and stated that they were 67. It's not Eric. It's Asian. Asian. Sorry. 
Essien yeah. uh, counted them and Robert Essien counted them and say yeah. it's 67. Yes. You did not count them but you knew they were over 50. Yes. I okay. knew. Yes. 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 So what happened after that? Didn't I see if so whilst we are waiting at the Sally, we had a call that in July, uh, mid July, we would take off to Europe. So we must to have a big canoe at Mbu so that we can use to join the vessel at Gambia waters. So whilst we are waiting at the house, we found a canoe is coming from the direction of Mbu to our place. It came with uh, over, I think, nine Nigerians and uh, uh, other guys included. Because as for the nine Nigerians, I was specific because when the canoe came, there was a conversation going on within the Asian and uh, other guys in the room. Oh, we have nine Nigerians added to the passengers. So well, that's thank why. You for to me, thank you. Thank you. Good. Yeah, now you uh, uh, And then what happened after? And then so, they see uh, So we left from Bar uh, Sally to join the vessel. So whilst we are on the sea, there was a communication between Captain and the organizers, I'm talking about the ACN and Victor Odru and those who are close to the captain. Yes. Oma, no more bear captain, no. Yeah, you know, I'm not going to get out of here. I'm going to get out of here. In the meantime, where, is, where was Charles Taylor? Sam Reno, not Charles Taylor, where he? We was taught that Chastila was in the vessel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. said that uh, Chastila no more a hemanim. And that is that was the vessel you were supposed to join at the Gambia waters, correct? Yes, that's a man, and I say more the Gambia waters, me boy. That is what they told us. So no, I'm not catching So when you mention captain, who are you referring to? And what was the discussion between him and Robert Essien, as far as you know? And Robert Robert said, Captain, give him a uh, go ahead so that we can join the vessel. So the time we left uh, uh, Sally, we are all informed that we are going to join the vessel as giving directive from the captain to the ACN and other guys to... Robert can say, Captain, what man or can say, one won't cost me to know, or moon and I, or my being say, or move a can't know, or more Who was in charge? Of the vessel, of the boat that you took from Bur. Mana na odi akontieni nim. Shemana amudi fi Bur no. What I later found out that they went to Bur to hide from the canoe, from the fishermen. Yes, so they hide from Bur. Wamu kaji every a a a far from ho e wambu. And then you guys took off from Bur and uh, went into the seas in order to meet up with the vessel in Gambia waters, correct? Because that is correct. And what happened afterwards? The time we get to the waters in the night, we find it difficult to make calls. Our batteries run down, and we find it difficult to locate where the vessel is. So we found there is a light ahead. Mra yedro pono sono na yehu se ya battery nini na ash eko form entina ye 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 dinse ebeti mi 
aye aye contact so those who know gambia started saying that oh this is gambia let's go there and buy cheap so that we can have proper communication gambia no ka say gambia ni enti no yanko ni yanko to same card so we arrived in gambia port early in the morning around 5 45 to 6 o'clock a.m at the port that's what you said right yes oh port yes and what do you mean by the gambia port could you then port yes because the time we get there there was a uh, ships around where there was a loading of containers and uh, offloading containers. Ye drew honona a ship be braces ho, at yes, and now containers cramp Yes, and then? So, early in that morning, we get to the Banju port and uh, we decide to send some of our guys to go and buy a chip and make proper communication to the captain i'm not part two to know now you buy an air cast or monkoto same car said you buy it you beat me at any captain or casa so six of our guys get down from the canoe yeah mommy is here is he from a freaking a hermanim who were those six sound crop for remember the sound crop for siano okay oh my one i can give you the three of them bits because I don't know all of them, I can't remember. But the three. Let me up on me and said, Give us one can be mean to me. Give us their names. Robert Asian was a man. Robert Asian. Yao Eric was a man. Yao Eric. And one Daniel. The short name and was that Daniel. Daniel. Yes. Okay. So three out of six, huh? Yes. Okay. All right. So, and then what happened? It's then is here. Immediately they get down from the canoe, we had a gunshot. Yes, see free. So, those at the top started shouting, they have been killed, they have been killed. So, we returned the canoe from the Banju port to other side. Later, we found out the place called by Barra Beach. But uh, how many gunshots did you hear? No, it was about eight thousand out here. It was about eight thousand out here. I heard two gunshots. Eight thousand out here. Yes. Okay. Eight thousand out here. Eight thousand out here. Yes. Okay. Eight thousand out here. Eight thousand out here. Yes. Okay. Eight thousand out here. Eight thousand out here. Yes. Okay. The canoe owners said that the contract has been ended. It's just one night contract, so they want their canoe back. You drew Barano and now, but why a high money through a monoca say, Yes, a contract, no, I see. So we decide that they should return their canoe back to Mbu so that we will find Chastela. So we sent three of our guys to Barra Town. Another three. Another three. And who are those this time? That three, the one I remember, Tazan. Tazan was a man. Uh, Tazan was a man. Yes. Yeah. Tazan was a man. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Tazan, what is his full name? Tazan. The name I know was a thousand because it's not someone I know from far so we just miss with the name. Azan and Kwana minimum. And uh Victor Udru was a man. And I think other guy, just which I forget his name. Victor Udru so kaho and I nipa ba kubin so. What happened to the group? Did they remain on the boat while Victor Udru and Tarzan and the third person went to Bara or did they discharge from the from the boat? Into my group no a den is here. Not as an come home, not Victor Drone come home, Moja or Momo Modin can call you and ask a more do don't know a den pan is here. At the Bara beach, the canoe guys left with their canoe, so we were discharged at the Bara beach. So we decide to send three guys to Bara town so that they can locate the chastila.
Hema urafu wano wamu fae Entino Yeye se Wamu waka no Yeye sumo wako Bara ako uwe chastila So they They retain With the news That Chastila told them that he haven't heard from The guys who left in the morning Chastila kachi wamu se Wamu bae no Wamu kase chastila se Onti wamu ka these guys, you haven't heard from them. So, supposedly, maybe they have been arrested by police. So, he will send Lamin Tunkara to go around to... If he can uh, have them in police station and grant them bail, so that we can join an even time, we all can join the vessel and make our journey. So, the rest passengers, there is a canoe at the term, uh, ferry terminal there. We should negotiate with the canoe guys so that by evening we can have a canoe to join the vessel. And you know, the say, you know, you know, you know, you know, you the process of finding a canoe, they came to a guy whose brother is a policeman. Now, here you a a na police ni. So, the three guys who go for canoe was arrested at the Barra Police. Tino wa omoko e ha e canoe no e chi omo e wo Barra Police Station. That is Tarzan Victor Oduru and that, somebody other else. guy, yes. No, I had Tarzan Victor Oduru knew before fro. Sure. And then what happened after that? Today so, is here. at the evening time, we are waiting for canoe, and definitely we have, uh, the, we see the three medium size of canoe heading towards where we are. They came with Victor Oduru. Ah, uh, you say, her mommy and say, Biba, na na ba kono na Victor Oduru or team. So immediately we found they are coming with Victor Odru. We thought that this is the canoe that we have sent for. So now So it's become like everybody was angry why we have sent for canoe early in the morning and this time you are coming. So it's become like insulting the have so we joined the canoe. Now you both if you say so after joining the canoe, we had a saying in Ghana that Kuti. Aha, na ye 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 tra hemani mono. Na ye ka bibi se Ghana kase mse Kuti. Ye kase Kuti anete se police ni. So when you hear Kuti, it means police. Here Kuti means dog. Here Kuti, etre se kramai. So, immediately we heard Kuti, we know that we have been arrested. So, if we have been arrested, we are going to, the initial stage, we are going to Europe and we have been arrested. So, we don't, we, we don't have anything in mind that we have been committed serious crime. It's just our money and the time and the... Uh, has been gone, so that is what come to mind. So Europe and we are in the hands of police. So the Western is going back to Ghana and you lost your money. So that's So arriving at the ferry station at the Barra side. He drew a bara a ferry terminal. No? There was a waiting policeman around a, a, over 20 policemen with guns awaiting now, there already. Now police for best uh, do you know? A agent at home could tell you. So when you come down from the canoe, you hold your brothers back here and they line us straight to Baratan police station. So we see from say pair, let's just say what's our new mo. And now almost sound more like a call Barra Police Station. So at that time, one of our guys jumped over the Barra Town Police Station wall. It was not high. He jumped over it, and the police found out that one half jumped. So the police surrounded at that place. 
na nipa ba ko huri eh wo no enti na ba asa no e ma police for ko twa e da ne ho hia the one who jumped do you know his name nyo huri e no unim ni din denis 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 deben denis or hene kwachi he was living in germany now He's living in Germany now. Yes. Dennis Oheni. Kwachi. Kwachi. That's right. Okay. So already six people, seven people have not been accounted for. Yes. That is the six who were originally sent to Banjul. Yes. Uh, that includes Robert Essien, Eric Yao, Daniel, and three others. Yes. And now you have Dennis, Dennis Ohene Kwachi. Yes. So to make seven people. Yes. All right? Yes. Proceed, please. So, a man came in and his open office. And when you go in, you present your ID card and any document that you have with you. And you write your name at that place. And you be by now, you be a and you know, who rema, who kwa, no watch you now, why the car now the actual? The statement of two ladies were taken at the Barra Police Station. Which two ladies? Mommy and Ben. Maku and Janet. Maku and Janet. Yes. 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 And take half from us at the Barra Police Station around 7 p.m. Dia ne ya kano omo ba omo be chemo mienu be se nonso ena omo fa bako. So they 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 take the first batch and they put them into navy vessel and they brought them to Banju Port from now, Barra side. Now omo ya fa omo omo di omo ko navy hememu ena omo di omo ba Banju. So. Around 9 p.m. at the Barra police station, they came for us and we joined a white 207 bus to the ferry terminal. From, From Barra police station to the terminal. Y yes. Which batch did you take? The first batch or the second batch? I joined the second batch. What time did the second batch arrive in Banjul? second batch Banjul. We arrived in Banjul around 10 p.m. to 11 p.m. We arrived in Banjul around 10 p.m. to 11 p.m. We arrived arrived where in Banjul were you taken? After joining the vessel, they brought us straight to Banjul port, where immediately you come down from the vessel, you meet a soldier. In fact, in the vessel, that is where the soldiers started coming in, and they started beating us. See, they were drew on us, pen a soldier for a straw for no much than hunting. We drew why near near Boasum. So the scene changed at the time we left from Barra police station to the ferry station. You can see that the environment has been changed. You see, how did it change? Explain. It's, it's about soldiers, soldiers with cutlass. It's not about asking you where you are coming from, but rather beating you. As far as our Mukutan Sekai, and your baby are free, they mom near bow. You said soldiers with cutlass, cutlass and guns. Who say as far as no Mukret, your name? Yes. So, initial stage, we, the way they are beating and the things going, we thought that they are going to put us in the sea. Yeah, Jiri said, Wobber Triago, a Pumu said, and no Missy Buya no Cranty. So, we were brought to Banju port. When you come down from the vessel, you meet a soldier with long cutlass. So he put the cutlass at your top here, and he just tear it, and all your shirts go down, and you put it at your thigh here. He just tear it, and your trousers 
is off. They drew by you, Port Nashi, Penetres, and Suja Fuku, Ewa, Mukutasika, and you know, the Shawata, the man who are two at the Nature's own Honda. So, at that time, we found it difficult to identify the first batch was there. The first batch was there at the Banju port. Already? Yes. And their hands have been tied at their back. And their shares have been taken off and left their underwells. Now, you do on the one day, can buy and on that, say, I teach you on, say, Eddie Guo, Mochi, HSA, one more Pietum Kuanaka, a show. It's not about three security officers or 20 security officers, it's about a mess up of police and soldiers. So, how were you able to tell the distinction? Yes, a soldier for a third year, any opposite for a third year in uh, everywhere. English. <laughs> uh, thank you. The, the soldiers, you can identify soldiers from police based on their. Uh, their, their, their what they have been putting on, what they have been well, and the equipment that they have been putting on. You can identify that this is a soldier and this is, uh, and also they have their badges and uh, their names on their chest. Who met me who say, We are police in here and I say, Soldier, ni a free attardena or on channel. Are you able to remember any name that you saw? Who met me a car, a dimby, a home, what are the name? At all. No, 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 I can't remember that thing. They be mint mint kai. You said they were beating you guys. Uh, from when you went inside the vessel, the navy boat, to bring you to Banjul. Uh, did they beat you? Fiti me na moura sheman mo every banju ana mo ba banju no. Uso ya bomo ni ya bo ubi. Severely, I was beaten up. Ya bo me pa. Could you describe how you were beaten? Who beat me at church in a bow? In fact, they have the police take that day you can. Uh, they have the police takes in their hands and they use the back of the guns and sometimes uh, the edge of the gun. They just beating you. It's like they are beating you here and there. So a guy who was protecting his eye, his, he was not fortunate. The, the, the stick get his, his teeth and all of a sudden he lost. All the front teeth, just one time. We drew our own the truncheon, and now it you know, H A E Abra no Bobo until we be cry a bono man. They see to it. So it's not him only. Under other guys, there is a big marks, a, a blood flowing everywhere. In fact, you find it difficult to identify. Do you, do you remember the man who lost his Ajamo? Who can you only see to two? You know, his name is Ajamo. The day the Ajamo. Proceed, please. So. About seven minutes time, a soldier car came in, and they say, you people must join the bus. The bus is no meeting, so no, police is car by, no, car say, at this stage, all of you, uh, your top clothes were removed, yes. and, uh, and your trousers were torn. First batch, they have been taking off their shirts and their trousers. Some of them did not have stains under. So if they found out you are not wearing pants under, they did not take off your trousers. Yes. Yeah. So that's what happened. So some of them, they left their underwears and some of them are wearing trousers. So we joined the by a soldier bus which came in and those the first batch hands was tied at their back. They used the one group one wire to tight all of them. So when they finish this guy, they use the same wire to tight another one. So no one is free to move anyway. In a sense, they were bound together in a straight line. In a sense, That's what happened, Council. So, they said, join the bus. 
But your group, were you also tied? No, at that time, we're not group, tied. No, we are true. There be. No. So, with the second batch, our hands were not tied at that time. So, we have, we must rush. Because the beating is going, where, going on everywhere. So, the first, the first batch was tied. They joined the bus, we the rest joined the bus. So the beatings continue in the bus. So from the uh, uh, as far as you can see, did did anybody did you see anybody try to stop the beating that was going on? So kaya sa bumono. Ubibia e try se u jai and na u si sa e brono kaya na. No, I did not see anyone trying to stop beatings. But as they were beating you, did you hear your beaters, your your assaulters saying anything? Yes. While they are beating you, they will ask you questions, but they will not allow you to answer questions so that they will know who you are. They will ask you, what do you came here for? Do you here to throw your jamai? You think you can destroy the destabilize our nation? You kill you? Tell me, Omo Boye no na Omo Busaye and some name Omo no Omo Maya kwa Emma and Kebi. Are they Omo Bahasa Omo Betuye Abayana? You see, so we left at the Banjo port and we get to a first police station and there was a shout, "Tell you get down." So we. The people who have been not been tied, we have chance to get down rather than those who have been tied. A dear free band you port no, and I, your dear co baby, do or no, Motia Chemise, Munsi form, and to one more yachty tree of money dear, or went to me a Omohan yaha, and I yachty tree and Momo dear, Yahuaha. So, do you know, do you know uh, exactly where you are where you dropped off? Who mean baby potsia, ye see mo, a walk. At initial stage, I don't know, but later I found it was Bundum Police Station. Actually, I'm who say Bundum Police Station. But was that the first stop? Yes. Or after several stops? That was the first. Stop. That was the first stop from Port. How many vehicles? How many buses were used to transport you to ferry you? Bus no 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 do do send a demo call baby a shemano wano shema station wano bus do do send a demo call baby a shema station no wano from Barra police station to ferry station. I bus no no do do send en an e demo call. Okay, from Barra police station to the ferry station before we came to uh, Banjul Port. It's only one uh, 207 bus that transported us from Barra Police Station to the ferry station. But from the port to Bundum Police Station is a bus, a soldier bus that, uh, that carries us from uh, Banjul Port to ba Bundum Police ba Station. But I a 207 that is a free Banjul, a bus that is a soldier for can I buy a buy? One bus carried everybody. The bus back on a demo in a buy. The bus that have a, a, a door at the middle mm -hmm. and the front. So it was people, those who are not being tied, we use the back, the middle uh, way to enter the bus. And those who have been tied use the front way. So it was like striking for your life. And the soldiers are after a so It was a bus with two doors, two gates. Yes, a eh, bus can see na a prono ye me nuntino eh one yan chichu won e de na womo e eh, pro mon kwana on wa chichu omo de ne de omo afa e chiri ho e pono no Do you recall with whom you were drop off at the station at which you were dropped off? Okay, in Crofo a woman who see or sabe be kuna e see mono wono. Yes, I can give you some of the names mm -hmm. right. Let me have my wedding be see here. Yes. Eric Ketia. We have Edmond Kumi. We have Kwame. Rich, uh, rich, rich, uh, uh, rich, uh, rich. Kwame? Uh, Kwame? Richard Bwachi. Richard? Bwachi, yes, he's a Kwame. And, uh, uh huh. Uh huh. I'm I have Martin. Yes. Uh, Eric Ketia. Fee. Huh? Fee. 
his name is Kofi, but we call him Fee. Kofi? Yes. Kofi what? That is the only name because that's the first time I met him. So Kofi? Yes, K-O-F-I. Mm -hmm. Kofi? Yes. Kofi, uh -huh. and then what? And then who? Uh, Americans. And so we have a Nigerian also amount as in ourselves. Whose Nigerian? Name? Yes. We have one Nigerian amount as in ourselves. How many of you were at that station, Bundung? Bundum Station Hall. First day we was ten. First day only ten? Yes. Yeah. And the next day they came for two. They came for two or they brought two? They came for two. two. They came for two of us. They took away two they of you. They took away. So ten of you at Bundung sure. Station. Ten and they Bundung Day one. Station. Okay. And those two who were removed from you, for two, no. where are they from? I'm from here. They are Ghanaians, but I don't know them. I'm from Ghana for the minimum. But in your earlier statement, uh, you said that uh, at dawn, say between 1.30 a.m. and 2 a.m., two Senegalese were removed from the group. Also, I don't know. I bought one at home. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I not I don't know. And the remaining eight, seven were Ghanaians and one Togolese. And then eight na a car, you know. You must seven your Ghana for. And then you pay back your Togoni. No, in our police station, we were ten in number first day. The next day night, they came for two guys, and they brought in Lamin Tunkara. Na ye ni pa edu na adiachi ya no omo beyi mi no en omo de Lamin Tunkara ebai. Okay, so that left nine of you. Yes. From, from Bundung uh, Station. Yes. Okay. Oh, Do you station. know who these two guys were? The two who were removed. Some you know number four. No, only microphone number. No, Councillor. I know at the first day, second day, they are Ghanaians, but because we did not live together and I don't know them initially, as time goes on, I just. Why you gonna form them? But a name of minimum thing. So this suggestion in your statement that these two who were taken away were Senegalese, that is mistaken. Yes, yes. They came for two guys. But though there was Senegalese among the group, who did we came from uh, Dakar? And the American, I know the I am from so a moment Senegalese for Uma, you know, free Dakar by. Okay. So and in your group, instead of ten. You are now nine. Tunisi, I'm a group no. Say I'm only a nipadu no. I feel more by a crown. First day we are ten, and the second day they came for two of our guys, you are and eight. they brought in Lamin Tunkara. Okay. Okay. But you do not know the names of the two guys no, that have no. been taken. No. Do you recall what time of the day they were taken away? They came for them at the night. At the midnight. There's that time. No. The night you arrived there or no. the next day? And I next drew on and the next day. No. In Bundum police station, they came for the guys at the next day. And they brought in Lamin. And they brought in Lamin. Fantastic. Okay. And then what happened after? No, then see. Uh, sorry. In your statement, you have listed the following persons. Richard Boake. Richard Boache. Yes. Wando Antu. Ajo Anchi. Ajo Anchi. Huh? Ajo Anchi. Can you spell that? Yes. At the initial stage, the names I give you, I think I forgot the Kwajo Anchi, so you can add to. Yeah. Yes. Kwajo Anchi. Anchi. A N T W I. Okay. Anchi. Okay. Okay. So Kwajo.
Ok, Kwado Anchui. All right. Uh, Kwado Anchui, he was part of your group. Chikuri Anchui, no no come on. Yes. Ani. There is Eric. Eric Ngetia. Ok. Uh, there is uh, okay, Edmond Kumi. Yes. You mentioned him. Uh, there is George Amo. George Amo. No, Ajamo. Aj George Amo, no. In our source, I can't remember any George Amo. Kai George Amo, There was one Togolese? Yes. Ane. In our cells, there's one Nigerian. Mm -hmm. And the rest is Ghanaian. So, no Togolese? No Togolese in our cells. Baby, I want to know that Nigerian is back home. I'm going to go to Ghana. So, uh, in your statement, the suggestion that there was George Amo one and one to go is mistaken. Nti no ukrata sem na utkan no. A o ka say George Amo bi wo mu any to go list ni ba ko no eh enfonso ana. Uh Aja Amo is one who is amount. And uh you see open you will be so man answer. Why? In our cells there is no Togolese, but rather Nigerian in okay. ourselves. Okay. This Aja Amo, wasn't he amongst those? Wasn't he amongst Sir those? Aja Amo, no. Onka, umo abo mudi huna. Okay. No. 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 Hold on. Okay. Okay. That is Enok Kwame Amo. That's it. Okay. So he was part of your group. He was not part of our group, but later we joined him at elsewhere, which we are not rich. Okay. About okay. So now I'm trying to establish the list at Bundum. Yes. So that's Martin Chieri, that's you, yourself. Eric Nketia, yes. two. Edmond Kumi, three. Richard Boache, four. Kofi, that's five. The Nigerian is six. Uh, Kwadu Antwi is seven. Uh, Lamin Tunkara is eight. Left it's one guy. Hmm? They left it's one. I, I, I one just... person missing. Yes. Akani uh, Pabako. There is a name that starts with F. F I, but in your statement it's not fee. clear. That is Kofi. Oh, fee. Fee, the fee yeah. that's Kofi. Yes. Okay. All right. What is it? In, in the statement, in your statement, you have the following. Huh? Richard Boache, that's one. Kwadu Antwi, two. Eric, three. Martin Cherry, yourself, that's four. Edmond Kumi, five. Fee, that's Kofi, that's six. George Amo is seven. All right. Uh, Lamin Tunkara is eight. And uh, then you have the Nigerian guy. That makes it nine. Do you have Kwadu Enchi? Could you say, say the name again? Kwadu Enchi? Yes. Yes. Plus the Nigerian, that makes it nine. That's all. Huh? Sure. Okay. So those were all accounted for. Yes. But two have been removed. Yes. And taken away. Do you know who removed them? No, cancel. Uh, did you guys give a statement? Mama, oh mama, krata mo kama numa se ma etro krata so. The next day, they came in with white pickup and uh, the CID came. So when they take you from the cells, they handcuff you, they brought you out, they take your fingerprints, your statements were taken, and your passport picture. Adi achi ya no, omo ema ye 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 yi. You try, you try to your passport. Na, afi. Asa. That was done at Bundung Station. That was Bundung Police Station. Omeyo Bundung Station. And after all those details are taken, what happened? Omeyo San Yomani na no denesi. Council, just before that, mm -hmm. the notation that you have, the two who were removed from Bundung Station, mm -hmm. they were both Ghanaians. Yes. Not Senegalese. Understand? Yeah, Ghanaians. Yes. Thank you. 
Yes, and then what happened after that? Then they see you. So, at the next day, a wife of Lamin Tunkara came there mm -hmm. with a newspaper. And they see you Lamin Tunkara a year by or the crater nearby. And uh, but, but as far as you could recall, so okay, no. Your group did not make any stop. Anywhere before you were taken to Bundung Station. No, Council, we left Banju Port and the first police station they stopped was Bundung Police Station. It's where I have chance to be at the Bundung Police Station cells. Bundung Police Station, you too free Banju no honey bejinae. If you see those cells again, would you be able to recognize them? Sure. Uh, Mr. Chair, perhaps it would help to take the witness to both Kairaba and Bundu. After the testimony, he can go with the investigators and he would just identify which of those places they were taken. Absolutely. Please. Uh, thank you very much. So you would oblige us after this testimony, you would go with the investigators, you would identify the place, they would take photographs, and that would form part of the record. Thank okay. you. I Thank hope you. it wouldn't traumatize them again, again, going back to yes, that kind of, of course. facility. Yeah. If you, that is, if you agree to do it. I don't think there will be more problem. There will be no problem. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. So Lamin Tunkara's wife came with a newspaper. How do you know she was Tunkara's wife? Lamin Tunkara yere no or the krata abaye na si dena hu say Lamin Tunkara na yere. We are at the cells with Lamin Tunkara. So when the woman came, she was pregnant and she came with another old man and she said, "This is my wife." Na ye nyina ye wo eh cells ya ni Lamin Tunkara nti na yere ne ba ya se pe no ka se we e ya me Okay, all right. Proceed, please. And what was contained in this newspaper, if you know? Newspaper, we have a story. 50 foreigners have been arrested at the newspaper. Mm -hmm. And the next page, we have eight dead bodies have been found at Brufood Forest. The news so initial stage we don't know that is these dead bodies is part of our groups or we don't know that they are killed, started killing us so we so we spent over a week getting to two two weeks mm -hmm. you spent what we spent more than a week at the bundum police station cells so one night they brought in the car they used to carry the prison inmates. And I do be one of the prison for car no bar. Mobile. They came Can with. Can you describe this car, this vehicle? It was a car that have uh, 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 it's like a container mm -hmm. that have a small spaces, mm -hmm. dot dot spaces at the top. And there is a, a chair at this side, long time, this side, and this side, and the middle there is no chair, and they open from the back. It is a cargo van. Na in two kwang kete kete de daho, na yebi a free tour. What color? If yeah, you color oh, no, I think the color was not much my attention at that time, so I did not. Meet me who said the nice city color crop. Okay, proceed please. So, what time in the night did they come? It was, it was around 11 p.m. So they came for five of our guys, including me. And we meet some of our guys at the, in, in the car. Okay. Just take it a little bit, huh? In your group, you have yourself, Martin. Yes. You have Eric yes. Kessia. Yes. There's Edmund Kumi, Kumi. Richard Boache. 
Kofi, uh, Aja Amo, a Nigerian guy, and Lamin Tunkara. That's right. Okay. Now, just a minute. Let me check whether these names were also in the main list that we have. Just a moment. Mami, I say, Dina, okay, and one more list now. You won't know how. Mami, she, Mami, Mre. Ah, there is an important reason for this. I think that the mis the witness is a bit mistaken because the list that was prepared from Kairawa Station includes his name. It could not have included his name if he went straight to Bundo. Mm -hmm. uh, and also, let me just check the other names. You see, Erin Ketia is also there. Uh, uh, Richard Duache is also there. Edmond Kimu is also there. And so the names was taken at the Barra police station including all of us. police station, no, I don't think... The, when the names were being written at the Barra first, police station, the first... Did you see the names being written? Yes, I, yes, I entered and I present my card and tea, card and tea, and I write my name. You wrote your own name? Yes. The man was sitting there with white shirt. You go in, he take your name, and you present your ID card. Who wrote down the names? When I trot, trot, do you know? It's a man with a white shirt. Okay. Not you personally? Not me personally. Okay. I will send you a document. Messendo Krata. And just take a look at it. Nahe Krata, no, so. So. And tell us, honestly speaking, whether that's the document you saw yes, at the time or not. Sure. Okay. All we want to know is whether this is the document you saw. If it is the document you saw, so be it. If it is not the document you saw, that is also fine. Sure. Mr. Chair, I'm passing over to him, Exhibit 200. Council, you, Council, you have a minute. Yeah, yes. Mr. Witness? Yes. Did you see this document before? Council, the paper we write, uh, he, the man used to take on is a white paper like this, but I can't specifically see that this is. The orchard was, you know, a crater if it has a nine so mint mean carpet, he said, anyway. That is a fair answer. You see, the, in, the interesting thing is the lineup of the names. Uh, you gave us your name. Oh, bold in train. Eric Nkatia. Eric Nkitia. Nkitia. Uh, Edmond Kumi. Edmond Kumi. Kofi, Kofi, uh, Aja Amo, Aja Amo, and the Nigerian. And the Nigerian, you know. They are almost all grouped together. In this document. I was a crater also. Do you know a person called Peter Asire? Who may be a friend of Peter Asare? Council. If I know that maybe I can, this is the guy, but their names may be escaped me. Okay. Yes. Uh, but as far as you could recall, you do you were not taken to one place first and then to another. No. no, no, no. no. From Barra Police Station, we brought to Banju Port. From Banju Port, we joined a soldier bus straight to Bundung Police Station. Next day, they came for our statement. They sent it back to police station. Okay. Good. So, the next day they came. Uh, they, took, 
two people were to taken away. Yes. Lamin Tunkara was brought. Lamin Tunkara Edenebai. His wife later came to visit. The wife Saba Ichri. And then the next day the CID came, took your photographs and you CID no be fa mfuni and mo ano asem And thereafter that night at around 11 this minibus this uh, um cargo van came Itine. and you were put in there. Ntine samre na na cargo van no be fa mo. How many of you? It's not the same day, can't The yeah. next day. Yes. We spent oh, sorry, one, about one week. Yes. Yes. We spent about yes. one week. And uh, this is the process our, our statement and fingerprints was did. Yeah. They brought in Victor. Mm -hmm. You see, Victor Udru. Mm -hmm. He was a guy who can speak both French and English very well at that time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they, Victor so, Udru by, if you say, or Cabro for the French. They know? go with Victor Udru from police station to police station to take the statement. Do you know, mm -hmm. they, Victor Udru. A so they station. brought Victor to our place mm -hmm. to have our statement and they sent him to another police station to take the rest of the statement. So that is how our police, our statements was taken. Victor, you the one baby I want to if you want to start and call police station for fro. You see, the list we have, Victor Odru's name is not there. Victor Odru is not there. Uh, what the reason why we're doing this is we're trying to also establish a list of all those people who are involved. Yes, and I say, if you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't, you This list we have contains 51 names. List I want to know, you can't, you can't, you but you told you told us that 67 people were in. But now, so more, you can't, you can't, you can't, we know that six. Had jumped. Six had been sent to in Banjul and ah, woman, yeah, a small woman. Woman. Yes, right? we right. also know that one jumped. That say is Denis Kwachi. Eh, Denis Kwachi. All right, that makes it seven people. Ah, man, yeah, so. We now know Victor Odru has not been so, 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 so if you add that to this list. It it would would be be 58. No, 50. 7 plus 57. The guy had that jumped is 58, and Victor Audrey would be 59. Yes. Already. Yes. You understand? Tarzan, Tar we don't know yes. whether he is on the list or not because. Tarzan or but let's say, let's say uh, that, that's what we have. Now. Uh, 59. Okay. So what happened afterwards when they came to they came at night after one week uh, with that vehicle? How many of you did they take away? They, they came for five of us. Over five, Who were those five? I myself, Edmond, Edmond, uh, Martin. Edmond, Edmond Richard Boachi. Edmond, Edmond uh, Richard Boachi. Wadu Antri. Wadu Antri. And one Nigerian. Uh, Antri, ah, that is, Antri is, what's his full name again? Wadu, Kwadu Antri. Kwadu Antri. Yes. And one Nigerian. So. And Nigerian Ibako. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And what happened? Where were you? see. He need mukoye. He brought us to uncompleted story building, a white uncompleted story building where it was guided by police with guns. Omo de ye ba baby, eh dan bi inyan sinu ye. Na je say a police for ho, omo kuta tuo. Do you know how long it took for you to get there? Okay, I'm ready to do a di ansa na muti mi dru baby amudru ye no. 8 to 12 minutes time. Bese miti and what we call do me no more. And then what did you find there? And then now was a police with gun around the house and when you enter the comp a hall, there is a police with guns sitting down there. So they tell us you must go and sleep. So a dano mukomo you do one say 
a police fo ekutatuo na bi nsu so ejinejina ni mu ho ene dane ho na uko edane mu nsu so a police fo ekutatuo so you left you must have left behind lamin tunkara yes ntuja lamin tunkara ho ejamu aja amu uh, eric eric ketia eric yes. ketia and uh, and uh, yes okay. you left okay. lamin tunkara aja amu eric tunkara eric ketia eric ketia and somebody else kofi kofi you left those behind. You we went back for them again and brought them to where we are. Okay. They went back. Including Lamin and yes. everybody else. Yes, they went back to Bundum Police Station and brought them to uh, uncompleted building where we are guided by police. police station police That is story building you said it's a story building did it look like it is in the town or yes. do it look like it's in remote places it's, not in it's within the town yes. okay. so when you arrived there who else did you find there at the place there was a police around with gun and uh we entered the hall and our bags that they took from us at the uh, Banju port was kept at the hall there. I don't, could you say that again? Uh, we enter at the hall and our luggages and the bags that they took from us at the Banju port was kept at that place. Some of them have taken their bags and they left it small bags around in that hall. Did you find any members of other members of your group there? At that day, we were the first batch to enter at the hall day. And the second batch? Yes, the second batch including Lamin Tunkara and the guys we left at the Bundum police station. No. And allow me to carry any one or car or Bundum police station. Where other people brought that? You didn't go for from Subaho. No. So at that incomplete building, you remain nine as nine people. You don't complete the people now. No, 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 Yes, they came with uh, other uh, people. Yes, other, other people. Yes. by Do you know them? Yes, they are all Ghanaians and Nigerians. And they are all Yes, they are all Ghanaians and Nigerians. Yes, they are all Ghanaians and Nigerians. Yes, they are all Nigerians. Yes, they are all Ghanaians and Nigerians. Yes, they are all Ghanaians and Nigerians. Yes, they are all Ghanaians and Nigerians. Yes, they are all Ghanaians Yes, they are all Ghanaians and Nigerians. Yes, they are all Perhaps uh, I should I should and bring the, this to the attention of the commissioners. And the victor was amount. Jo just a moment. Uh, uh, just a moment. Maku is Juliana Maku. I raised this for some reason because the commissioners had asked questions about this. Juliana Maku, that's Ghanaian. And the other lady... Janet, uh, the list we have here, just a moment. Could you say again? Yes. Number 44 is Tano Janet, Ivorian. So these two ladies were brought. Yes. And then Victor was amount. Victor Oduro was also brought last. Yes. Yes. So now you are how many? Nine plus three, that makes no, twelve. No, they are not three, they are four. They are four. Maku? Yes. Janet? Yes. Victor Oduru? Yes. And? And one guy was a mount, and that, I think he was a Nigerian. Yes. And, and, and a Nigerian? Yes.
Ah, well, he doesn't know the name. He doesn't know the name. Ah. Does the name John Ameze? He didn't John Ameze. Does it? What? Bring what did that? No. no. Okay. David. No. And then what happened? She didn't see it. So, they, they told us, you must sleep. So one man with one police is just holding gun and is facing you. So when you want to enter the washroom, you ask permission, he go with you. Uncle say, now, police need to watch you, person call back from Grana. So after 15 to 20 minutes time, we had a car coming in. So they open the, uh, the, the gates to the compound and uh, a man step in with a white shirt, a long cutlass. And now, the best uh, meeting, uh, do not call me to you, no, no. Papa be by no shot, I did if it are no good as a kind. Also, he was followed by three soldiers with a cutlass. As you are for me, and sons who did not you, I'm And gum, and they have been tied their hairs. It's not easy to identify them. Yes, now one more I hear you. One more could tell you. Now one more thing so much it's right. And yeah, they are waiting me. What do you What do you mean by they tied their heads? They are not easy to identify. Some. Then our patch say how much it's wrong. It's not only me home. Some some of them have some black scarf to tie it. To cover their heads. Cover their heads. We know much it's wrong. But it it is said they are from force. Some could wear their. Some did not wear their. Some did not Yes, sir. What color uniform did they wear? At that stage, I would say the color of the military as ordinary people, ordinary person can identify that this is a military. No more soldier for what are Proceed, please. So the man said, he stepped into the compound, a hall, and said, You people must go and dress. We are going to release you. So you get into your bag, you take in your shirt, you put on your trousers, you just search because everybody, some people have taken there, so you took what is fitting you, you well, you take back. So they will come for you from the compound there, they will hold it, your hand and send you to the outside the house. Okay, yeah. When you get to the compound, they take off your shirt again and leave it your underwear. So the guy who is inside no know that you have been naked outside or you have been taken off. So the first four they use a black wire to tie their hand, including their necks. And including their what? Their neck. They use the wire to tie their hand at the back. They use one wire. So when they finish one wire with me, then they use to another guy. They use it in four in in four peoples. And you want the wire at each row in saddle, a coachy, no more side at each row call. I would be answer so no my and a sign, I just a move to what to say, you know. Uh, we want to understand really how that is done. Yes. Can I have two, three TRRC staff come to the middle and uh, the Jewish. witness will demonstrate how that, that is done? Can we have three people come to the middle? Yes, could you? Yes. yes. So, they tie your hand at your back like this. Mm -hmm. Yes. They tie to your hand at your back. Yes. Mm -hmm. At your hand back like this, mm -hmm. they use the same wire to tie this man back. This man's back here also, uh -huh. you see? And this man also, they use the same thing to tie his hand both here and also my hand. It's like this. And they use the rest of the wire to tie to your neck and you are looking up and they use the same wire to tie this guy also neck. So they are all looking at. But, but, but how would you get into the vehicle? They push them. When after the, the, the tightening take place uh -huh. outside the vehicle, uh -huh. so after that you go close to the vehicle, then they push you. So when you get down with your chest, 
other guy also lie at the left hand and other guy also at the right hand and the guy at the top is sitting or lying on you so if you are in for you now the oh my yeah you know sana pepe pen and yeah it's true and sa echo much you know And you said it's a wire that was you. No, it's a wire. Yes, it was a wire, but it's a soft. It's soft, so they can tight it well without you doing anything. So the first four was pushed into the pickup, and they placed their bag alongside them, their bags, their luggages. Ane na ye wire na yasusuno ne mo emrenti ni etmi chichiru o ye enti no. So they came for first four after they came for another four, and I was among the next four that they came for. Omo be far na e di kano, actually no mo se be far na na actually di no be far na na me kano. But our wire was not too long as compared to the first batch. Yeah, your wire no na e ni tin tin ti se wo di kano. So after they tried to use it on our neck, but it was peace, so they did not able no, to go use it. So uh, did, you, did they put the first and the second batch all in one vehicle? In Tino, Momo, a teacher, Mono, a fine decay for no, and a Momo Tosuno, a Dimuina, a coup, a car back Moana. Yes, Anne. We also, they pushed us into the, the same white pickup and they placed our bags. The, the two soldiers want to join the bucket, the pickup bucket, but it was full. Yeah, and then you know, the other say, Oh, no, so so young, so see a PIS are a to move. Now, the bag at two and chain, not soldier for me, non compass on car, and I am not. I And they decide to bring in two ladies, but when they consider their luggages, it was too big, and they say, We are going to release this after we come for the rest. Some person, Ketisia, me, no, 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 so the ladies remain behind? Yes. The ladies, the ladies Eric and Ketia uh, and Edmond Kumi, we left them behind. Yes. And then what happened after that? And I didn't see it. In the car, it was me, uh, Victor Udru, Richard Boachi, uh, Lamin Tunkara, Eja Amo, uh, Nigerian, 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 Eja Amo, Tunkara, any one of my people, Mudin, can you know? Nani, na Nigeria, Niba, Konsu, can yes, Kwadu MG, Kwadu MG, so no, can you? Let's get the next again. The, the Nigerian, yes. Lamin Tunkara, Victor Oduru, Kwaju Anjui, yourself, huh? Yes. Richard Boachi. Six of you, or more than that? Yes, we the are. The Nigerian, Lamin Tunkara, uh, Victor Oduru, Kwaju Anjui, uh, Martin Thierry, Richard... Uh, Richard Boachi. Boachi, uh-huh. Yes. Let me two guys. Edmond Kumi, did he let? Did yes, we left Edmond Kumi back. Um, okay. Ed Edmond Kumi, the one Kumi. Eric, and Eric Nkia. Eric Nkia, yeah, we left him back. Chance, right? How about Kofi? Fee. Yes. Fee was among our group. And then I feel in Susu Kahu. How about uh, Aja Amu? No, Aja Amu. Yes, Aja Amu was among. He also yes, was part in of the pick, in the pickup. That makes one, two, three, four. Eight of you. Yes. So two batches of four, four. Yes. Okay. And then what happened after that? The it. officer said, if you don't want to die, don't jump from this pickup, okay? The officer said, I won't pursue you. I'm going to free him. 
Say yes, sir. So we asked Lamini, where are these people taking us to? He said, let's pray. So we take north direction from Banju. We go up. We face the up direction. So from wherever it from was, from the wire house. From that white house. Proceed, yes. please. So we get to a point when the Nigerians the, the one Nigerian he started praying. He was a Muslim. Allah Wakuba. So the voice was up. And was so the man stopped the car and came in. Who is that? The driver no ojina car no no ba no si huaya. So the officer came in with the cutlass and bring the guy down and have his backbone here and use the cutlass to cut his backbone. So, and you know oba ya no. And uh, just a moment. Uh, in the list, I'm just looking at the Muslims on the list on the basis of the names. Uh, just a moment. There is Suleiman Abdullah, but that one is listed as Ghanaian. Yes. Hmm? You say that? Six, Kasim Amadu, also listed as Ghanaian, yes. but you know Kasim, yes, yeah, so no it Kasim. could not be Kasim. There is Aruna Musa, Don't know him. but is listed as Ghanaian. Would Aruna Musa be a Ghanaian name? That would sound more like a Nigerian name to me. Aruna Musa, would that be a Ghanaian name? I don't know any Ghanaian who was named Aruna Musa. There is also Mohammed Bayo. Mohammed Bayo is more Sierra Leonean than in fact Ghanaian, but is listed here as Ghanaian. I don't know Mohammed Bayo also. Mohammed Bayo would Definitely, most definitely be a Sierra Leonean oh, name. All right. <coughs> there is also Asan Conte, that is Sierra, obviously Sierra Leonean. Momodu Korkajalo, that's Sierra Leon, that's Senegalese. John Amezi is Nigerian. The only person listed here as Nigerian is John Amezi. But you said this person was praying in the Islamic way. Yes. Okay, let's proceed. So, after that guy suffered that serious injury and he was breathing over like, <laughs> and the blood started flowing, and uh, we get to Untied Road. So now, that after how long? After how, after how long in the trip? You see, in your first statement, you said they took you from the warehouse at around 1.30 a.m. Yes. And uh, at about 2.30 a.m., you hit a ship. Yes. The time we left the tide route, on tide route, the forest route, there was a village after this guy had the serious cut, the car branched from the tide road to untied road, and the car knocked a ship. And they stopped the car, and they brought the ship, the dead ship, between me and Kwaju, and the officer said, you are going to travel with this ship tonight. Now, yes, free coat and also say, per I seen for the corner, so no. Did they say? And now, car no, a ball, or giant be, and now, officer, no, for foul, Jano, a buyer, no, see. One who we say, one in the bed to cry. Did they slaughter the sheep before no. it died, or is just the dead carcass, the carrion that is just put? Omukun, Omukun, Abuano, and son of the Nebetum, and I said, Mukan and Ebo, Abuano, and I didn't bet to Car knocked the sheep, and the sheep was already dead. It left the blood coming through his ear and his mouth, where blood flew in the They placed the sheep within me and. No, 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 Ebo. 
Ojano, Minty Ojano, who ye and Omad in a bye about two Muse, one who drank one in a bit too quiet. Between you and who? Are you empty? Yes, are you empty? Yes. So, definitely we have knowledge about what the man is talking about. That you are going to travel with the dead ship. So, in the forest, we branch from that road also to a forest road where the pickup is finding its way through the forest. How oh. long have you traveled? We spent, it's not more than two hours, but close to two hours from 11, 12 to around. Yeah, Because it was midnight. But you were not keeping the time, right? No. At that time. So, so the time you provided is just a guesstimate. Yes. Proceed, please. Yes. So we get to a place that the driver stopped the car, and uh, two of the soldiers with gun came to the uh, bucket, and they came for our luggage bags. And there was a valley there. You drew baby no omujina na a soja for me no a by tree and to know omu de yenema and yina a by ho. So they took our luggage into the valley and whilst they are in the valley, because a jamu was at the down where everybody lie on him because he was at his chest. He's sleeping with his chest. So he complained to an officer with a long cutlass that he should help him to turn so that somebody will go down and he also have some small rest. The man used the cutlass at his shoulder here. Though the hand was not completely off, he just cut and asked him which one is more painful. <laughs> Were you able to smell the breath of these guys, these officers? Utimi ete omuhu hia sa officersi na uti omuhu atenka. No kwase mi ye se se di amin timi man man kase mi ti omuhu atenka biya. Kwa that time ano na eni brana ni pawo mano na enye. I could not remember. I could not remember. Okay, that is fine. That is fine. Sorry about that. Proceed, please. Proceed. At that time, we are at this very serious moment where you are going to be killed. So, when you get to any barrier, they just opening, you are going to be killed. So, what is in your mind at that time is, you know. Sam Randy and Nim said, Quebia, so Ombe, yeah, Ombe Queen, you know, thereby, yeah, you might say, when you are quiet, I say, Johnny. On that Johnny, did you come through any checkpoints along the road? Sam Reno, I'm going to na I'm going to be a number of checkpoints. Yes, there was a barrier, but they did not stop us to access anything. And na a quano, na a woman, and so no be a musae be a bia. So, how do you know that you are going through checkpoints? You basically know who said, I'm going checkpoint. Yes, when we get to any police barrier, they just stop and they talk to them in the other language, then they open the barrier. This pickup, did it have any cover? Pickup, we not be big at all. No. So your group would have been visible to security officers who were standing at checkpoints. Intenshe se mu group no security officers are never open so definitely no umbe humo. Yeah, the security officers may know that yes, there is a people's in the car, but because it was night and our hands are in the pickup, so it's not easy to identify 
what is going on within the pickup, but you will see that the people say they're not mercy at each tree, you know, a be a police for no mujina kwam no be who nansu so no or multi me who are the kudia party if it's an a anajo. But as far as you know, uh, there was no attempt to stop your vehicle uh, and and be searched. But send our train and I should say, oh my, oh my dream be I say, oh my big jina, mokano, na ya shishimu, nye me woman, nye koso. Nowhere at any point. So you went up to this valley and they came, they stopped and took your luggage. Valley Hono, Bonka Numono, Aumujna Mokano, a farm on Yemano, at the Komu. Yes, two of the soldiers took the luggages and bags to the valley, while two of the soldiers, one officer with a long cutlass and other guy with a gun, they are watching as whilst their guys are in the valley. I mean, you know, the Yenia man, I'm going to go to Bonka, 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 I'm going to go to Bonka. So, as far as you know, what were they doing with your luggage? I'm going to go to Bonka, I'm going to go to Bonka. At that time, we have already have completed mind that these people are going to kill us because what's happening on our way to where we are and uh, the way Ajamo has been cut off by Kalas at his shoulder, what's going through our mind at that time is that God forgive us our sins. And Sam Reno near Bompire, copy me say, Jamo said, You see this kind of channel, no, not your Bompire say, said the young couple, Eddie, your boy, and from Sobech, if he said, Yen, him see a guru. Yes, God. So you no longer cared about your luggage? No, at that time it's not about luggage, but it's about. How you can convince Yaya Jamez ugly so just angry who are going to kill you? Say they be young, who be to me aye as as far for no mu kuku no. For how long were they at the valley? Imre do do send a no mu obon kanemo. He spent few minutes and they came back. They did not do anything, but rather give us a little space to discuss some issue. Who discussed some issue? Man, I discuss it, baby. The two guys who went into the valley, they came and the officer took them uh, just about a few meters and he speak to them. Oh, I got two bags in the gooey and I'm a buyer now. I'm a name, you know, I can't. I'm a tea, I'm a two edge now. And in the meantime, where were the bags? No, some red room, no, 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 no. They did not come with our bags and that increased the sadness and uh, that. Let us know clearly that. Your bag no one sound far my bill. That makes us known clearly that your bags has been already buried. So these people are definitely going to kill us. What happened after that? I didn't see. So from there they joined the pickup again and they decide to move deeper to the valley. So at that time, uh, the military, the officers who who were guarding you, were they inside the cabin or at the back with you? Asrafo no, I no mu bomo hobi no. No mu e ibonka no mu anas no mu ka no mu. At that time, you see the pickup double the car, the one you, you used. You mean double cabin? Yes, double cabin. You need to push the seat of the other side, the one who sits beside the driver, before the other guys can enter at the another car. Mm. So the man who was at the front with the driver is with the cutlass. The driver was driving. And the other two guys with gun passes behind the first man beside the driver before they can get to the second car. Mm. And we, the eight, uh, uh, I don't. I want to. I don't want to know the name we used yes, to qualify right now. So they are for me, no, no. Omo di omo kutetu. Omo no omo ko bonka ni mo. Na ba kono driver ni no. Eni di okuta se kano di. No omo team. Ne chesa di no. Kano. E kwa mi nu pe de da huwa. Ube timi akom. So in at the bucket is only the V A eight and it's full. So there is no. Military at the back, at the back of the car. And you know, actually, honor, I am my anti soldier, Nibia, you are no car. 
Other guys say, if you go, they will kill us fast. And it's like some people decided to give you message. Oh God! Enti diye eba ene se kujio kachira me se o shemingkuna se ko ne bino monsu se ah ukwa ebe kuye. What kind of messages? Is there you see? Tell. Um, in Sambia na no muke kachira. You know, someone will say, Ajamu said, I live at. Abuakwa and uh, my wife and my children are there. If you have chance to go, try to, you know. And uh, other guys say, I'm from Western Region. And uh, other guys say, Oh no. It's not war or woman or not. We will be a extra nature. I said, They're better. Yame Buano, call bit me a couple of bush and four a man. It's like. It's like I don't know. You are going to be killed, and uh, I'm from here. I'll go and tell my family. Go and tell my people. It's not. Enti na omo man in class said the beya. He said the medical cano. Obe ti mi akobo one bush ya four amane. Say asembisiya. And. Uh, it was at that time I decided to jump from the pickup. Didn't you make an attempt to free the other people? Knowing that your hands were all. I decided to help them. But the way the wire has been tied, very tight, well, I tried to remove Ajamo's uh, wire to here, to, to knock here. I was not able to take it to here because when it passes through the nose, it may definitely lose. But it gets here, and the car was about to stop. And so. I decided and I tried, and they said, if you do make sure, if not, go and they find out that you have your hand off, they will just kill you at the spot. So I decided to run for my life. So you jumped off the vehicle while it was still Yes. Moving. Yes. While the pickup was moving, I jumped and I heard a shout at my back, who is that? But I did not look back. I have first, second, third, fourth, fifth steps, and I was tied by something. It brought me down. And I was tied by uh, some stacks or ropes in the forest, and it brought me down. Immediately the gunshot is passes over me. 
And tonight, you know, I said, Nami Triso. So I decide to relax small. And dear Basse, Majima Home Kakra. So I found out the open a big torch light. And Timmy, we said, What would they touch a simiso? When they threw to this direction, they shoot at that place. And this almost they share her no more to two or home. They throw the torch to another direction, they shoot and make sure that they shoot every door. All the place. And he said, "No, we see a net. Yes, I'm to two two. They said, 'Yeah, be ya. I'm pushing me. Oh, I'm kebab bombing.' So I decide to have small time. Immediately, I wake myself from the ground. And he, I'm really free. I'm meeting me sorry, Kakrano. I heard it was about ten ten steps, and I heard a shout at the back. The Radio, a Radio. God save us. God save us. And he me. Two men I can cry and make you say, "Oh, my God, say, ready, Jiyin, we're ready, Jiyin, you." And gunshot follows. And now I do have to talk. But I don't know that I was just close to the road because it was night. Now my name say, "My Ben, a a quant quantum pono." If it's a na, a anajo. So I found that. Proceed, proceed. I found that the pickup is the pickup is coming where the light was coming. It's heading towards where I am. So I throw myself to the for the bush and the pickup passes to the right direction and I use the left direction. So I spent four days in the forest there try to protect myself from people because I was thinking that if I go to anywhere they will arrest me to the police station. And the midi na ene na ewo forest ni mo. If you say na mi suru se, say mi ko e krebi asia wa anju anoma beti me. No mo de mi ko police station. What did you do for food? And then now we say we did yemo. There is a tree in the forest here. In our place, it's common. It's like coconut. It bear fruit, red, yellow, red, like coconut. Is here. It bears red fruits. Do you ever been there? We're more ho. You you cross your horns. So I know you're my mo Ghana. So it be a hunting. Oh, is that the palm tree? Yes, it's like palm tree. But it's a tall one. Bear fruit, round, round, big, big, red, red. So in our place, we we eat that thing. So it was full in the forest there. So I decided to hide myself there for strength because I've been in the cells. About one week and hit more so. Do you ever be nigh at the Cubano? I be what you crew Montina, no, no, meet me, dear, ran up a war, real Mohono. So, in the fourth day afternoon, I I found myself in a place where there is a straight line that they have been cleared. And could, I, could you say that again? You found yourself I found my place at a location where they have been. A straight line, they are with the place street. You can locate from here to locate far. And I read that this is the same thing. So, when you come from the forest to the other side, they have cultivated granite, and uh, there's some cottages, villages there. At this stage, how were you dressed? Some pimpin' so we na na wa 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 na wa shew. I was with my underwear. Na me piu tungu ane shame. Underwear, so only underwear. Only underwear. Proceed. So when the farmers set the eye on me, they started running away. Enti ai kuyafu na muhu me na muhu frasi gane. And the oldest men among them approach me, and they ask me where I'm coming from. And in penin for na omo omo diye omo eba menche ino busa me se hifa na me free. In which language? Oh, kasa bemo. In French. Omo kano wa French mo busa me se hifa na me free. Yes. And how did you respond? Yes, I hear French. Mete French de kakrenti. Do you recall what exactly they said in French? Okay, asem pa omo kanye. Yes. They asked me, Tiva who? Omo busa me say me ko he. Which translates to where you going? Yes, Tiva who? Where are you going? Come at it appel. He di monom. He di Yesu Ghanian. Yesu Adaka. Omo busa me say o o di di say o eh o ya fro we say o free hefa na me catch on me say me di di say me ya Ghana ni. 
We are, we want, the VK va faire un bac à main pour aller en Europe et on est arrivé à Gambie, on a resté dans la police. Yeah, yeah, thank you, yeah, call Europe, and I, yeah, 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 by Gambia, and I almost, yeah, 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 you know, baby, yeah, my bedroom. So, it gets to a point that they understand all what I'm saying. And you do, maybe, I just almost, yeah, yeah, me, can you, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do, do you know the name of that village? My name is Abbey Kona Okwe no Niti. It's close to Bunklin. I see a bear Bunklin. In Kazamas. In Kazamas. Oh, Kazamas. What happened after that? I didn't see. So they said they give me cow milk and uh, rice at the afternoon. Oh, my mom and then she no food. Any more? And they give me shirts and uh, slippers to wear, and they give me trousers. And they said this place is close to the border, and we are farmers here. We don't have any protection. So oh. this is the road. Oh, my mom, at a day she, and now my papa no more can say. Yeah, 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 yeah. We are for any baby hour has it. In the meantime, did you form a conclusion as to what might have happened to your colleagues when you had them saying, "God help us, God help us." And then you had gunshots. Some pempen swore no. A barwa dream near na aye at two on crofona now do a monamno. Send a no more kick him say rather boy you, rather boy you. Never why dream near na at two. For me, the time they are shouting, I was just close and they pick up return and I see the pick up. No one is inside the pick up. So. Media don't know who you say. Eh, Satamana or Moka Sani, you know. Na a idea may be in tea and chibiana pick up no side down and home by a mixture and that will be any. When the pickup was passing, I just want to see if they are still in the pickup. So I just raised my ha head small and nobody was in the pickup. So the pickup take the right direction and I take the left direction. So me, ma'am, and this one on a me who say, eh, pick up no be any, and you know, pick up no fire and the first one I mentioned me far being come. Based on what's happening on our way to that place and what I have passed through, I do not have any doubt that they have been killed. And now you are near boom killing. You've been given uh, a shirt, trousers and slippers and told to go. Where did you go? See an I am out, oh, bunkel and I am out at the ashe, do you any idea? Yes, a coin in a hen or coy. The first village I arrived is where they offer me such and they show me a way that I can go close to a route from Second Shore to uh, uh, Dakar. That was where I can locate a big place, a big city, a town, so that I can have medicine. So I walked small and I get to another village where I slept. So next day. So the next day a guy came in with a donkey that they used to carry granites. So uh, the villagers asked him to take me to a highway. So I arrived in the evening, and that place also was a village, and there was a Jandam camp. So immediately I get there, the villagers escort me to Jandam camp. The gendarm took me and they find me a place to sleep and they do a wireless message to the Adeshwet capital, which is Bonklin. So next day morning, uh, Amoka came from Bonklin Jandamali camp. It is Jandam Marie, no more mommy baby die, and no more any woman crop from Penny for the Dinkitaho, and T. Adeche, you know, Koso. So they brought me to Bonklin where they sent me to hospital for treatment. And uh, my fingerprints and passport pictures and the statement was taken. There. So 
after some days that they found that I can go back to Dakar, the gendarme gave me some money and they write some notes to me and they give me another road that I can use Koda, Koda Road, so that I will not pass and through Gambia. You said, what's the name of the road? I use Koda. Kolda? Yes, Kolda. Okay, proceed, please. Yes, so I have my way back to Dakar where I later come to know that no one was responding or no one has been heard since we left uh, Mbu. You know, dear Bayer, and they say, me bombarding group Dakar, and I hold on a me who say, Ye ni na ye free mbu lo, obi ye ni huwa ya tine nke biyo. So, now I came to know some of the guys who initially I don't know. Because when anyone heard that one of the guys has come out, definitely he come and find out uh, where his brother is. And you know, me dru honon su su no, daka no na, che se, omo te se ma ba no. So briefly tell us what happened in Dakar, which, which, uh, which led to your eventual return to Ghana. Ntine kan ye si wa Dakar wa a enam su uti mi ba fi e wa Ghana. So in Dakar, there was a Nigeria counselor who also came with other Nigerian guys whose brothers was involved. And there I came to know that nine Nigerians also was involved. In the Dakar, so no Nigeria, a embassy hono almost obi free hold by our bearish and in me. I hold a me who said Nigeria phone crones so a can yeah. But you told us earlier that in Moor, when the vessel, when the boat came, it came with nine Nigerians among others. Yes, yes, but there was that. They came with Nigerians, but a specific number, I was later find out that this is the specific number because it came with Nigerians and Tola also is shouting, nine Nigerians, we have get nine Nigerians on board. Ampa, the Eba and the Edi Kano, meant me on who one more do a chain of me who ye, if it's a Tola Kase, Ampa, Yenya, Nigeria for and Kron, Eka Akayo. So by specify of the councillor, that makes us, that makes me understand that. Yes, indeed, there was a uh, nine Nigerians on board at that the time. Councillor, no, the Obeka, you know, I'm meeting me who say, I'm part Nigeria for Uncron, and so not Omokayo. So, uh, this this group of six that were sent initially, uh, you mentioned three Robert Essien, Eric Yao, and Daniel. Did that group also include Nigerians? Robert No, I can't tell that they are Nigerians because uh, actually I did not see that uh, this is the guy they, they just left. And the guys, oh, the six of them are going to make a call. The six of them is going to make a call. So those who I'm close to, is the uh, Yao, uh, uh, Asian, Yao, and the Danish. They have been to me in Ghana, the mom, the American, and they say, woman, I'm a bear, Yao, and a Danish. So while in Dakar, it was confirmed to you that at least there were nine Nigerians involved? Yes. What happened after that? So I sent to, I was brought to the mission. Ghana mission in Dakar for my statements and fingerprints and passport picture and that was the place I stay for Ghanaians also to brought pictures for identification. And they make a Ghana embassy to Dakar. A hold on now. Make a year in Crawford so buy a chess or more so a very good one. So I spent some days there for identification and uh, later on we had uh, news that if I did not take care, some people will come after me in here, Dakar, so I must to rush to Accra. And today, I say, I am going to say, I am going to say, I am going to say, I free Dakar, I am going to say, 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 I am going to 
Accra with uh, Councillor Mauto. And Councillor Mauto, Anna, many a call and crying. He handed me over to CID, just Mr. David Asante Apiatu, who was the CID. But initial stage, they sent me to Foreign Minister, who was uh, at that time Nana Akufuado, now our president. And now, Mr. Uh, David Asante Apiatu, on a no CID boss, Sam Reno, and now. Sisi anzo sano na na ado danko eku fwa do awaye Ghana president no sata amu no 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 ya foreign minister and uh, later Mr Apia too brought in speeches of some dead bodies for identification. Iti etre no si a di boss awa no awa Ghana no ode grofobia omo wuno emu eba se me me she se minimum ana so I was able to identify some of them who I know and have the pictures for their families also for confirmation. Enti mitimi etre nkrofobi wo ma na me me ni wo e na omo abusu afo so so e ba e be fo aso. How many were you able to identify? No mo say na otimi ehu tre 6 at that time because the dead yeah. bodies was 8. And who were those you were able no, to me identify? No me e hwa no mo. Ajekum. Yes. A G Y E K U M. Ajekum. Ajekum, what's the last name? Yeah, First name? Could you say? No, it's only Ajekum, Ajekum. I think Kwabana Ajekum, but. Was it Kwa Kweku? Kweku Ajekum. Kweku and Ajekum. Ajekum, yes. Okay. And who else? Yauchre. Yauchre. Yes. Uh huh. Abari Kasim. Abari Kasim? Yes, and uh, one old man from Mampon. So we call him Mampon, Mampon. It's the only, his hometown's name is Mampon. And Mampon. that's what we call him. Is it, uh, all right, sorry. Uh, we have Abari Kasim. Uh, Kasim, we have Amadu. Is it, or is it Abari? It's Abari Kasim. Abari Amadu Kasim, you know. Abari Amadu Kasim. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. And then Mampon. Yes. Hold a second. Uh, uh, if he's from, okay, we have Yao Chiere, hmm? Mampong. I don't think we have Ajikum also. Yes, we have Ajikum, Ajikum Kwaku. Uh, Mampong, Ampadu. Mampong, we would not have. Yes, um, we have Ampadu. You said Ampadu. Yes, Ampadu. Yes, Ampadu. We have. Hold a second. Ampadu is uh, just a moment. Uh, number ten. Yes, Kwadu Ampadu. Yes. Yes. Kwadu Ampadu. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then who else? Um, it's two for five. I have one more. Yes, I think I'll I'll give you the one and uh, okay. and also it came to my notice that these eight dead bodies. One half chance to escape to Ghana Town Police Station. Hold a second. Uh, check what you've said again. One of the eight body, dead bodies escaped. They, they, to Ghana they, Town. They, 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 they discovered the time they are executing them, one half chance to escape to Ghana okay. Town. Okay, in the group. Yes. Of the eight people. Yes. Of the dead bodies. Eight people. Yes. Uh, there was another person yes. who wasn't killed. Yes. Who would have made them nine. Yes. Who escaped to escaped. Ghana Town. Yes. What's the name of that person? Kwabna Fosu. Kwabna Fosu. Yes. Where is he now? Oh, he is here. It's only Ghana Town police who can tell. That's right. So he was handed over to Ghana Town. It's in the name of Ghana, Ghana Town, Town Police. Police. He ran to the chief of Ghana Town mm -hmm. at Ghana Town. Mm -hmm. And the families and the Ghana Town people came to conclude that mm -hmm. no, Gam Gam Gambian soldiers cannot do that. Mm -hmm. Gambian police cannot do that. So some say, Indeed, let's. Gambian police cannot do that. Gambian soldiers cannot do that. It's become like they don't understand. Mm -hmm. So some came to conclusion that let's give this guy money to go to Senegal. And they say no, let's report to the police. Mm -hmm. 
Eti gana ta ho de ba ni se. O mo se ye mangrofo esika no akwa esika no ko Senegal. Ebi no se de bi ye fa no ko ma police fo. Fa so minia. So they brought this guy to Ghana Town Police when he was arrested again, including the chief of Ghana Town at that time. Mm -hmm. And then what happened? So, Kwapana Fosu spent some days at the Ghana Town Police Station where people used to visit him, and one day they went there, he's nowhere to be found. Now our Ghana town police in Susono, that could be one more coin or one more one be The interesting thing is, Kuabna Fosu either has a different name. Yeah, we must say Kuabna Fosu. No, I better say we would info for. But he is not in the list. Was on can list now. That was prepared from Kairaba Station. Is it possible that he was amongst those? Among the six who were sent from Bara, from Banjul, to go and look at what was happening. No. No. Kwabana Fusu was not among the three guys who we sent for uh, Kanu. No. The six? The six. No, he wasn't. He wasn't? Yes. But the, the issue we have now is that he is not in the original list. Yes. That we have. Yeah, what I say? Nidi enka mukrata ne di kana eba eno. Nidi enka. Because the expectation is that if he had come to Banjul with the group. He would have been in the list. Because ne omu se sanko kahona omu ba banjula anka ni dimbe wakrata anaso. You see, the time we get to Bara Police Station, some of our guys have experience of traveling to other countries where they have been arrested in such situations before. So you see, Dan Dennis Daniel Dennis just jumped over the thing and go. So maybe Kwabna Fusu may decide not to write his name. It is possible. You see, so the story after I have based on the eyewitness and those in Ghana town, the guy came and he was very hurt. And uh, according to his story, they get to the forest at Brufoot and they found out that soldiers are ready to kill them with knives and cutlasses. So, Brufoot forest, no, Omu who say. So yes, no one could tell it to you any in Sikai are on place on Kuo. How did that happen? Yes, so Kwabana Fusu said that there was a Nigerian and uh, other guy actually, they are very strong guys. So they decide to fight with one soldier and tell him to run. It in Krofo be ah, just say no more, the Omo who are doing or money a soldier for it in Tamiye and Omo catch a Kwabana Fusu say own journey. So they tell that is what the story I have based on the chief of Ghana town and those who what's, witness. What's the name of the chief of chief Ghana no, town? Chief, no. Yes, I can give it to the commission, but later I can I make sure to okay, give it. Okay, we write it on a piece of paper. Write it on a piece of paper. It's not right now. Later I will find out because I will contact him. So that's No problem, no yes. problem, no problem. Obviously, these are things that uh, you don't have an intimate knowledge of. You were told. Yes. Right. So, Kwabna Fusu was arrested again. Yes, actually, Kwabna Fusu Bio. At the Ghana Town Police Station, where people used to visit him every day. And you know, Ghana Town Police Station, and Ankro, for Costa, and Omribia. So, he was the guy who told the Ghana Town people that that's, this is what's happening to us. Yesterday night. Into Onona, or catch a Ghana town and Crofone say, near a two year and run a junior. But the people did not believe. Now, one genuinely, so they decide to send him to Ghana town police for a report to be made. And you know, Omo Kase, Omo de Nubako Ghana town police, Amana control and Numasem. And then what happened after? And he went with Ghana town chief and the elders at that time. 
And it's not the only chief who was arrested. The chief and his elders, including Kwabana Fusu, was arrested and later they, they have bail and Kwabana Fusu was not granted bail till now. And up to now, Kobna Fusu has not been seen. No. So he should be considered as disappeared. Yes. So the time we left at the uncompleted building. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let with other guys in the building. The two ladies, Eric Nketia, Edmond Kumi, and I think one guy at the uncompleted building. Also. So, this is the people I can say that yes, I left while they are alive. I did not see that they have been killed. I haven't seen their dead body anywhere. But the time I'm living at the uncompleted house, they are there. I'm free. Baby, I have one on Dana. I ain't seen you yet. No, so I'm close for we see. Because this year, me no no. And I, me ma me and Sano. Now me who say, Omo di Omo ti ase no mo ho. Give us their names again. Bobo Omo di Inche. Eric Inketia. Edmond Kumi. Maku. Uh, hold a second, Edmund Kumi. Maku and Janet. Maku. Yes. Maku, that is the lady. Yes. Janet. <laughs> and I think one guy, maybe Fee or something like that. One guy or there's Yes, Fee. Mm. Hmm? Yes. Okay. These five. Yes. <laughs> So after you went to Ghana, to you met Ghana, with no. the CID, yes. you met with the then foreign minister, now president. Yes. Uh, what happened? So the pictures of dead bodies that discovered at the Blue Food Forest was shown to me for identification. Yes. Yes, I identified them and have the copy of the photos to show to their families for them also to be at the CID and the Ministry I'm of Foreign Affairs for Confirmation. How, how were you able to trace their families? Yes, because the time the case happened, I spent some days in Dakar. So whenever the guys came, oh, I stay with this guy. He came from this town. He came from this village. So the time I left Dakar, I knew almost Ghanaians who I live around. So, so when you escaped to Dakar, Ghanaians in Dakar must have heard the story yes. and came to the embassy to confirm certain Confirmed. information. Yes, that's exactly what happening. And uh, we have decided, the time I left, I thought these guys are not going to be killed. So I'll make sure that definitely they will be released. So I moved from village to village, town to town, CID headquarters, foreign ministry to make sure that maybe they may be arrived so that we can do something to have them released. But my effort was not. So now, it's only Asian, Eric Yao, and Dennis, and Daniel. There are a few guys I can't 
record that. Dennis and who? Dennis and Daniel. Mm -hmm. Those who we, they are amount, the guys who we left at the Barra Beach to Banju, and they are the only guys I can testify that. Since 2005, since 2005 till now, I can say that yes, they have life and we can talk to them when it's needed. And you know, one more day, me name so much, I say, I just say, you beat me, and you won't think it at home. And but Osei Daniel, yes, Daniel Osei, yes, that man is on the list, yes, that is the one I'm talking about, Daniel Osei. Where is he? He's Germany. We have Daniel Ohene Quachio, yes. Because Daniel, Daniel, they are playing, they are two or something of that sort. And the names is, maybe we not call him Daniel, you know. Okay, okay. Daniel Osei is in, the, is in the list. Yes. But Daniel Kwachi is not on the list. Okay. So which one of them is in, uh, is in? Uh, we always use the Daniel. Huh? Daniel is. Which one is in Ghana? Is in Germany? I think Daniel was saying. No, Dan it could not have been Daniel Osei. Because right now people because use Daniel Osei is in the list. And in your statement earlier, you said one person jumped at Bara. His name is Daniel Den Dennis Oheni Kwachi. Dennis Oheni Kwachi. Yes. And one Daniel is also in Spain. Who was with uh, Yahoo Eric? And uh, Robert Isien, the other three, Robert Isien, Yahu Eric, and Daniel. They are the people who was arrested together. There are six and the three, I don't know. And this Denise jumped over Barra police station wall. Mm -hmm. He is now living in Germany. Okay. They are all, all who, uh, you know, wall, no? Say, say. Oti Germany. Okay, Robert Essien, uh, Eric Yao, and Daniel. The, 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 the problem with this, were there two Daniels or one Daniel? One Daniel and one is Dennis. I can record one Daniel and one is Dennis. Yes, but if Daniel was sent together with Eric Robert Essien and Eric Yao, his name would not have been on the list that I have. Yes. Because so it must have been some other person other than Daniel. For counsel, because I was not able to record everybody's name. That's right. It may be very difficult to recognize all the names and identify who the guy is. Uh, and if there is also a Daniel in Spain, it's either the Daniel on this list escaped, okay, from okay. Banjo. Also Daniel will be was Spain, and I said Daniel or what paper we used to know, Ujaneko, Spain. Or he must have been part now, of the six. Or, or can that, that no Yes, the Daniel, which I'm talking about right now, he was arrested at Banju Port with Isien and Eric. He was the Daniel, and the other guy, Dennis, was jumped over the Barra Town Police Station. Okay. Yeah, make us see. I don't agree. We say of any any commonality. Daniel now we can only know the work right here. We could tell you more. Now they were here okay. So of the six that came to Banju. At least three were arrested and accounted for at the Banjul police station. That's correct. And those are Robert Essien, Eric Yao, and Daniel. Daniel. Okay. So the other three have not been found. Not been found. Okay. So we have to account for those three. Sure. All right. And those three so are. So it means, therefore, there were three Daniels. <laughs> yes. Huh? You got it. The Daniel, who's part of the six, who were saved. The Daniel, in this document, which raises the presumption 
that they were executed and the Daniel that is in Spain? No. The Daniel who is in Spain mm -hmm. was a Daniel who was arrested ah. with Yahoo. Okay, all right. Okay, okay, that's fine. Yes. Then it means there may have been two Daniels. Yes. Okay, good. But who, so, is the, who is the one in Germany? Dennis. Dennis. Dennis, not yes. Daniel. Not no, Daniel. not a Daniel, it's Dennis. No, Dennis is in Germany. Sure. And Daniel is in Spain. He's in Spain. Let me get that again. Dennis, Dennis is in Germany. Germany. Yes. That's the guy who jumped over the, the fence. That's it. Was. And Daniel is the guy and who Daniel. was arrested by the yeah, police Chino. and held at Banjul Police Station. That's all. That's the guy in Spain, Spain now. Yes. Okay. So in our list, we have another Daniel who may be... Another Daniel amount. Because who may be amongst I, those who are I can't recommend... Uh, have everybody's name in mind. We uh, understand that. Yes. We understand. Thank you very much. But since then, you have made a crusade yes. out of this issue to ensure that <coughs> efforts are made to trace the whereabouts of these people, and that justice is done. Free Samreno, what could come say? You bet me in a searching a man and crop for our modisa to trust him. We won't crop for no more. No, 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 yes, and in Ghana. I have moved from village to village, town to town. At the initial stage, I was thinking about making sure that the rest of the guys may be released. But, but later, I found out that they have been killed and they are nowhere to be found. So I decide to make sure that justice must be served. So I came to uh, contact with Commonwealth Human Rights Initiative Africa. Commonwealth Human Rights Initiative Africa And uh, we make sure we did our best, and later we have eight dead bodies from Gambia. Uh, Gambia we were told that they are the bodies. We were told that they are the bodies of our fellow Ghanaians. Which at this time, the families are not too sure about that. And ah, Jesse, omo abu shi afo, omo inti mi hu, so omo ti asi o, ana asi omo u. No autopsy was done at that time. No verification. Even the coffins that they brought from Gambia was not open. Inti no di em pa ene se ni pa na ya di omo ba ya no ya nye ayi ayi bi mu bi ya umu se ampa omo no omo ana asi nye omo a impo no ada kano. But you must be aware that there's been cooperation between the Gambia government and the Ghana government <coughs> regarding the bodies of those Ghanaians, which resulted in the evacuation of those coffins that you talked about. Do you know say a government of Ghana and a government of Gambia no more didn't get a home on Kumomo, a far same So far as I know, there haven't been no compensation so far as this case is concerned. Yeah, but, and, and conversation, so far as I know, uh, there was a conversation which, as a result, it came to a conclusion at the silt that those who are responsible for these killings are rogue elements. Rogue, and elements. rogue elements. And they are not, they are operating on their own. So, so we were waiting for a day that we will find the rogue elements. We are, we wait we have waited till time we have a common what a human rights watch tra international uh, CDD Asla and 
uh, Amnesty International and Media Foundation Africa joined Jamaica to Justice campaign. I just say, say no international bodies in Yanano, Yanuomo, Aye, I just say, a no, I see a Dijam, a Yaya Jame, a bar, no, obey a Brano Nenidi. And later we found out that there was a investigation team opened by UN and ECOWAS. Internationally, we say United Nations near ECOWAS and Susano, or more a year if you move in some be. But the sadness point. Our sadness part was that the UN ECOWAS also did not give even little respect for we, the poor peoples. And then there has been a say, yeah, and here for United Nations, the ECOWAS, no, and yeah, they are one more, and you know, because even to call the families and speak to them that we are sorry, uh, you are, you are, you, you lost our people at the Gambia and based on our first founding is a rugged elements so later uh, we will deal with it this is the, uh, the report we have nothing the like that's happening one moment me and kasa yes yes so a b a as a way see gambia now almost see rogue elements now a kumi and crop on the moment me and ka say oh we did a monk who but you must have seen in this truth commission that people that soldiers who actually carried out these killings came forward and confessed but um, um, say, carried out the killings. Um, say, in Shemu, we know, so just for no Eba, Eba become one of them, say, um, yeah, into dress them now, a course, no? Yes, because I know that the Gambia is taking new direction where people can live, so everybody is ready to vomit what he has swallowed. Gambia, um, bo, um, modern, um, let's say, um, as an Adan, um, um, Eddie, I share. So, for soldiers to confess, in the presence of TRC, I think is a great thing, but that does not stop us to find justice. I say, I for the I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, through through the Ghana government, do you, are you aware of that? We are aware. Say, as I see, you know, Gambian government, it's five thousand dollars. I'm a Ghanaian government. Five hundred thousand dollars. I'm a Ghanaian government. You know, I'm a ebusi ya fua omo odishi e ko sa tibia we mu. We ni misa bibisa. One thing the families and I normally talk about that the Gambia government have insulted us with five hundred thousand dollars to buried unknown bodies. The Omo can say Gambia government omo the five hundred thousand dollars abroad on H S or why did you want him? If you say nipa no the buyer no omo nim say omo a omo aye omo omo we omo crofo and I say nye omo crofo. And he did not said I'm sending this five hundred thousand for compensation. Wan kase or the five hundred thousand he ever ever. Compensation deal because he told us that he don't know who killed these people. The other kind is say, we need to go for our own and get this and run away. So later, if we find out who are corporate or those who are responsible for these killings, they are going to deal with them. They will brought them to justice, and the families are going to duly compensated. But because it's these it's killings it's take it's place it's in Gambia. Yeah, 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 who won our own, yes, I a tree trash and cook and would this same year, sir, and Randy Omudi. So, because this case happening in Gambia, in humanitarian grounds, we are giving 500,000 for the barrier service. And you know, there a one more 500,000 normal to buy any day, and yet, idea, a year compensation or not, a year humanitarian grounds in tra. Five five hundred thousand dollars for the burial of five remains would be some burial, wouldn't it? Yes. Five hundred thousand. Yes, because. But, but but Mr. Mr. Martin. Mr. Martin. On behalf of the entire Gambian people. It's not Gambia for in name. We say we are sorry for what has happened. Yeah 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 yes it. For me, I can, I can just accept. Moment. Just a moment. I can accept, but just a moment. 
like you said, uh, justice must prevail. Would you please continue with the interpretation? Yes, sir. Um, as I say, as such, this is just one step in the quest for justice. Be rest assured that the entire Gambian people and its government are deploying their best effort to ensure that the truth so of what has happened would no be disclosed. And once the truth is disclosed, no no be the road would be open for people to start be boho. Ma a de fache a juma. For people to begin to forgive and to reconcile. Na boom. And for the wheels of justice to start in motion and ensure that justice is done. Like you, we are all in for justice. And that is why we are giving all our best efforts to ensure that this process succeeds. And to ensure that no stone remains unturned. The bonds between Ghana and the Gambia are far too strong. Painful as this may be, it should only serve to reinforce the bonds and and connection boom and the peoples of Ghana and, and the Gambia. I work Ghana and the Gambia. I'm sure you would agree with that. Sure. Uh, on that note, I have just one more question for you. I would read out the list and you help us correct some of these names no, as far as you possibly can. Sure. You don't know that? No, I, I know there is Togolis, but I don't know his full name. Loka Esperant, Congolese. Do, yes. you know, do you know that name? I know the Congolese, there is Congolese, but I don't know his name. Good. Suleiman Abdullahi, Ghanaian. Yes, I may be, but I don't know him physically. Uh, Bright Antwi or Antwi? Antwi. 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 Okay, Antwi. Ghanaian. Yes. Kweki Antwi Ajikum. You have identified yes. that person. Kweki Ajikum. Kasim Am Amadu. Amadu. Kasim That's Amadu Abari. Abari. Okay. All right. So it should be Kasim Amadu Abari. So, so I am taking a list of the corrections. Huh? Yes. Uh, so that is uh, number six on our list is Kasim Amadu Abari. 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 Kasim Abari Amadu. Okay. Amadou would be the last name. Would be the last okay. name. Okay. Okay. Kweku Apia. Kweku Apia, yes. Kweku Apia. Yes. Benjamin Kobna. Kusu. Kusubena. Oh, Kabna Chire. It's Benjamin Kobna. Yes. That was Kwabena Fusu. Benjamin Kwabena Fusu. Ah. Kubena. Kobna Fusu. Okay. <laughs> so that is eight. Okay. Benjamin Kobna. Kobna is K-W-A-B-E-N-A. -E -E. Not, not K-O-B-N-A. Fosu, huh? Benjamin yes. Kobna Fosu. Okay. Nketia Eric. Yes. Kwadu Ampadu. Yes. Richard Bwachi. Okay. Edmond Kumi. Peter Asire. 
Dr. Asare. Asare. Yes, he is the choir master. Choir master. Yes. Okay. Peter Asare. A S S A R E. Yes. Huh? Yes. You call him queer master. He was. How do you write queer? Queer master was a guy name, so he's just a. K mas K K Q W A Q U A Y. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Maybe. So that's key master. So you call him queer master. Queer. Queer. Queer master. Queer master. master. Yes. Okay. Queer master. <laughs> All right. I'm sorry. You know these are the pro differences between Gambia and Ghana. The pronunciation. Okay. Um, <coughs> so that's Peter Asare, that's the choir master. Kwadu Antwi, uh, Chiere Martin, Peter Mensa. Yes. Emmanuel, is it Emmanuel Nati? Emmanuel Nati. Emmanuel Nati. That's 17, should be. Emmanuel Nati. N A A T Y or N A T Y? N A T T Y. N A T T Y, Nati. Okay. Yao Cherry? Yes, Yao Cherry was a moon. Okay. Asanti Isaac? Yes. Koranteng Machiel? Michael. Michael. Okay. You know him, right? Sure, sure, sure. I know him for well. Peter. Achina? Achina. No, the 21. Uh, 21. Uh, Machiel Tawia. Is, is, oh, is it Michael Tawia? Michael, Michael Tawia. Michael. How do you spell Tawia? T E W I A. I A? Yes, T E W I A. Okay. Uh, Peter Achina? Peter Achina. How do you spell Achina? A K Y I N E. A K Y I N E. Akina. John Carson? John Carson, K E R S O N. Yes, John Carson. Nelson Frimpong. Frimpong. Is it Frimpong? Frimpong. F R I M P O N G. Okay, 24. Nelson Frimpong. You know, this must have been written by a Gambian sure. uh, based on the pronunciation of yes, the names. Yes. There is fight shit. <laughs> that wouldn't ring a bell to you. No, no, no. George Amo. Yes, that was Aja Amo. Huh? George Amo. It's Aja Amo. Maybe, I don't know the name he gave at that time, but. Okay. George yes. Amo. A, is it A R M O O or A M O O? A M M O. Amo. George Amo. So he's Aja Amo. Yes. How do you spell the Aja? A G Y A. Aja Amo. Okay. Then Aruna Musa. Yes. Muhammad Bayo. These are listed as Ghanaians, but they sound very much a reunion. Johnson Ajire. Johnson. Jerry. Well, it says Johnson, which I imagine should be Johnson. Yeah. Ajire. A G Y R E. Ajay. Ajay. Yes. So you know this one? No, no. That's it's Ajay. It's but again. you you believe it should be Ajay? Ajay. Yes. A G Y E. It's Ajay. So Johnson. Ajay. How do you spell the Ajay? A G Y E. Uh -huh. I. Okay, Johnson Ajay. Ah, I, this looks like A G Y I E. Ajay. Okay, all right. Joseph Mensa. Yes. Juju Mengs. You don't know that. No. Richmond Boadi. Yes, Richmond Boadi. B O A D I. Boadi. That's all. By Daniel. Yes. You know that one? Yes, Daniel. Samuel Solomon, Sierra Union. That should be 34. This should be Samuel, I think, not 
Samuel, Hassan Conte. Ok. Uh, hold on a second. This one I'm trying is add this something dear coffee. I'd have to, anyway, the, it's Ivory Coast, so you wouldn't know the name. Juliana Maku, yes. Ghana. Yawi Mens. Yao. Yao Mens. Yes, maybe he's again because. Huh? 38. Yao Mens. Awa Pon. Awa Po. Awa Po. How do you spell that? A W U U A H. Awa Po. Po. P A U L. P A U? Po. P A U L. Paul? Yes. Okay. Osei Daniel? Osei Daniel. David Gibson, Liberian. Mumudu Korkajalo, Senegalese. Kweku. Awa Mful. Kufu. Oh. Kweku. Well, this last name is a bit difficult. I can decipher some of the letters. Awa Mful, something like that. Do we have John Akufo inside the list? John Akufo, no, John Amezi. John Amezi, we don't have John Akufo. Yes, there is Akufo inside the list. John Akufo. John Carson, maybe it's John Akufo. Yes. Hmm? That would be to number 23. John Carson. Should be John Akufo, huh? How do you spell Akufo? A K U F O. Yes. Akufo. Okay. Ah, Kweku J K. Amamful or Awafu Awamful or Awamiful. Amamfu. Yeah, Amamfu. Amamfu. You have Amamfu. Yes, because. Kweku Amamfu. Amafu, how would you spell it? A M A N F O. Amafu, okay. Okay. Tano Janet, Ivorian, John Amezi, Nigerian, Ismail Laku, Senegalese, Abebo Yawi, Togolese, James Okiere, Ghana. James. O Chieri or Jim Okeri? Ochiri. Ochiri? James Ochiri. We have Chire and we have Ochiri. Yes, this is Ochiri. Yes. Okay, this is Ch Chire is spelled the same. Yes, but yes. Ochiri, you add O before K. Yes, that's right. That's what we have here. Idrissa Toure, Sierra Leonean. Manila Alpha. Ghanaian. Isaac Amoli. Isaac Amo. Amo. Yes, okay. Good. So with this list, uh, now we have discovered this this one. Uh, Fosu. Abna Fosu. Kobna Fosu is Benjamin Benjamin Kobna Fosu. Benjamin Kobna Fosu. So Fosu is in the list. Um, so the three people have to be added to this yes, list. Yes, Uncle said Robert Essien, Eric Yao, and Daniel. Robert Essien, Yao, right. and Daniel. That would give us 54. All right. We have to add Dennis Oheni Kwachi. Sure. That would give us 55. All right. Yes. yes. And uh, Victor Oduru. Victor Oduru. Yes. That's the one we have to account for. Yes. 
uh, Victor Oduru. We don't have anything here that is similar to Victor Oduru. Do we know how it's Victor Oduru? You know what's happening at the Bara police station? Yes. The time Victor came for us mm -hmm. to the Bara police station, mm -hmm. you see, when you enter Bara police station, there's a compound mm -hmm. at the back of the police station. So the Victor, they send him directly to cells. Mm -hmm. The time we get to Bara police station at the night, evening time, they send Victor directly to cells. Mm -hmm. So he did not write his name when the man came to his okay. office. Okay. So after they are taking the first batch, they just go to the cells and open the cells and take away Victor. And I don't know why his name was not here because the Gambian authorities always go around with him mm -hmm. in Banju mm -hmm. whenever they want to. Because the time we are in the Bundum police station, some afternoon they used to visit, they used to come and check over. So when they come, I ask Victor, what is going on also? They will release us. They will release us. Let's pray. Even Victor himself is going around with them, but he don't know what is going on. Okay. So with, with this list that we have of 51, plus Robert Essien, Eric Yao, Daniel Victor Oduro, and Dennis Kwachi, would make 56. Is your list where you are coming now, Dean Boom now? You are 56. Yes. Plus nine Nigerians. And then Nigeria for nine. But those nine Nigerians are not here. Just nine Nigeria for no. Umudin and Kakrata no. Yes. We cannot account for those nine Nigerians. And number 45 is not among the nine. And number 45 is not among the nine. Because if he was. There is no explanation why the others were not. So that is the problem we would have to deal with. Yes. How do you feel now that you see the wheels of justice moving? Yes, I think it's in good direction for me and the families back home, seeing that at least giving you access to hear your case is a process of giving you justice. I say, a papa, ah, and I'm so busy. Say, yeah, the prayer prayer is too far from the nature. Say, yeah, no quality, and ah, yeah, perceba. So, I was not thinking that maybe something like this will happen in one day where I'm very comfortable here in Gambia giving my statement and no one is I just I'm not looking back. My na anyone that say emri bebe ba se se me nya kwan na makasa a se se bibia enha me ana se won so won ta machi no won ye ni papa. So what I and the victims family not only in Ghana, of course, I know there is a lot of victims here in Victim Center. We want to see justice. And I hope, appearing in TRC, we are in the right direction to have access to justice. And so I hope today people in back home will say yes, the day will come, we will see justice. And we hope never again Africa will be, especially West Africa, will be a place that we can move up and down. Na sa yen West Africa has say sa and some more dear and more din and I say a would this semi and my view. By asking for justice, what exactly is it that you will be self separate prayer you'll be seen a damn potting a woo ope woo dream a dream see so damn potting a woo he said prepare no a damn a woo a dream. Yes, we have 
stages of justice. Others think about having the dead bodies or the remains in Ghana and buried properly and uh, uh, honored is a way of justice. Others think about seeing the perpetrators, including Yeye Jame, being appear before competent court is a process of justice. And others also believe that the families need to be compensated because they le those who have been killed left wives and children, and they have bring a lot of problems in the family. Say, as a result. And I say one di bonnen so so ye do more farm raquaso, let us or mukujina court na yet to two ano. Thank you, Mr. Chieri, for Mr. Chieri, answering my questions. So we assemble yano. Thank you very much, Mr. Chieri. Over to you. Mike, Mike. Mike here, microphone. The smiling coast is the mother crying customer today. Hearing what we heard all day and yesterday as well, I'm personally shocked. Say a tear smile, tear, you see a higher smiling coast, a Danish crying coast. Now, me and Kasasama, me and Mati, me who dream ye. Devastated. Tomiso. Bewildered. And frankly embarrassed that these atrocities occurred in our soil here. In Carried out were by perpetrators who were using knives, guns, machetes, or cutlasses, and the inhuman treatment. This is a land I'm not known for those kind of atrocities. We're truly sorry for what happened um, to all these young African um, souls. Yes, sorry. Yes, the wheels of justice have started rolling. Our processes involve establishing the truth, which is absolutely uh, indispensable in order to move on. We will um, uh, reach our um, conclusions here in the Commission on what we have heard. We'll make um, our recommendations. And we hope that um, uh, the uh, justice would be done. Uh, we heard your suggestions. We heard your views. We would reach um, uh, some uh, conclusion. Yes, the victim should not be despondent. Sometimes the wheels of justice are roll very slowly. But at the end of the day, the mantra of this um, uh, exercise that we are involved in. It's never again. NC. Mr. Chire. Mr. Chire. You mentioned that this never again should not just apply to the Gambia, but to Africa as a whole. Sure. And I can't ask you any questions, Emma. Uh, on uh, what really happened and what we heard these two days. Uh, commissioners, if you have any questions, please um, uh, uh, proceed. If not, um, uh, Mr. Chair. Chairman. Imam, you have the floor, please.
Yes. First of all, I wish to congratulate you for your life. Thank you, sir. Dear Dikai, may she won't cry. Very few people in this world will have this kind of narrow escape. Se and can nipa I will be asking in a bit me and ya a quina of us with Janiana. I'm sure it's God that saved you. May you didn't say Yamina a Jonqua. I want you to tell West African migrants. Pese o kachre West Africa wo pese o mko Europe no. Particularly those going by the back way. Wo a wo nam eposo eko Europe no. Why they should not attempt it? Se di enti a ense se wo mo bo mo trimo krasi on beyesa. You have had the experience. Wo nya suen huno no. You have had the narrow escape that God has given you. When you are a quanky to a bina, Yanko Pond, the fast with you free mono. But more importantly, today, dear Ahia Pa and Ne Ne say, you are sitting to narrate the incidents. What, 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 ba I would be a dance here after this year. No man can do better than you to save our young people who are still trying to go by the back way. O be anywhere, O be to me, Aji Yang Unqualaya, on Pesce, or Mofa back way, a call Europe. No. I want to hear your voice. Thank you. Medawasi. Thank you, Chairman. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you very much indeed. Um, uh, Mr. Cherry, if you have any concluding remarks to make, please proceed to do Mr. so. Mr. Chair, so we'll be coming out of our country to our country. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. First, I would like to respond to the Commissioner's uh, appeal that he made. In fact, I've taken it on my uh, shoulders to campaign against illegal migration in Africa. The Edika no, me pese me yi commissioner asem na no, me amafatu me hunse me bu unkrofo abe muse omu mfa sa akwa anesu biyo. Because now it is taking different direction so far as illegal migration in West Africa is concerned. Se se die, die, at first, when we talk about this back way, we normally concentrate about male boys, male born. First, no see a case back way, and just see a case a man born. But right now, ladies have joined the party. She said, "Yeah, in Kitesi, I no cry at all." So, where people traffically move to other parts of the world to serve as house girls, and later found themselves in. Many on dangerous situations. Ah, and Crophobe Brace, he said, Ye, one more fat, a quabby, so say, one more corner mark or ye fear, Juma, Nancy, so no, a chasm, Yana, and ye papa. And also, uh, where the illegal migration, the knowledge start from, is where we must to tackle it. Baby, I dream, Eddie Bass, say, Yam Fapo, so and co, a brutal, a free, and a second, I have. Yes, so I know free. Because when we decide to block uh, the Mediterranean Sea or bring the troops, somebody who have traveled from Brikum, our local place, to uh, Senegal or uh, Gambia or Mauritania or Libya will not uh, fear about uh, Navy patrolling, but rather he will try to make a way that he can smart his way and uh, have his way to Europe. <laughs> I will free base a baby. I ye me free say no. A quay be as or beba say or be ye. I'll be condensed no unim a whole assem. So and crop for crampo and nampo so a moche. I won't pay say any baby a fasso. So I have started uh, educating them in churches, in communities, especially the women also involved. I feel my friends here say me church and crop for. Said the Beya, one will be jay, a war, mantem, mantem, any asore asore mo. In fact, sometimes the our mothers motivate the young ones to embark on such journey. When sometimes it comes to Finra, you need to put on clothes which speaks like your son is in Europe. The the Asian group of our young say. Udra Bruchin Kuan, Abinescano, a idea, a essay, 
ye ka ma ye ma me no wote fi se wo mu na ya na wo mpo wo pie pie ye se ye nko it's not all the time by ladies but some guys also have the idea from outside but mostly when you have a scare or a dangerous aspect from your parents or your guidance, it may be scare you and you have uh, male concentration on your education. Say, when you are a foot to a free fear, a quabia sono, a idea, a quack or toa, Gina, Sanya Manuajai. So, uh, I'm working hard to have some assistance in terms of logistics so that I can move from place to place and village to village, town to town, so that the education and the dangers involved in illegal migration can be addressed so that the young ones... Yeah, so, by conclusion, I think this is a great uh, privilege for me to appear in the presence of TRC. We are a Kenya pa a Muswa meeting meeting the Abba TRRC. Eha. It's not all the time about giving you something, but a lot of Gambians are listening far from Gambia here and in homes. Gambia for the brie eighty or more more Gambia ha and I say oh oh two coin. Not only Gambians alone, by I hope by this our story, Africans may choose the leaders who are supposed to lead us at a certain time. Eh, Mijiri say, ye Africans, ye be nya o kendini a ubetimi edi nukwae ato bebi eda. So I think the TRC is the foundation for future Gambia that we are all looking forward. So I hope justice will be saved and the perpetrators will be brought before law. And thank you very much, Mr. Commissioner. Thank you very much. Thank you very much indeed. Um, uh, we really appreciate your coming all the way from Ghana. Come and help us um, uh, establish. Sorry, um, uh, Council, you asked for a, a, a point of order? Or you may yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, Mr. Chair. Ahead. Just go one ahead. little thing. I'm still trying to resolve these numbers and the names. I have one discrepancy, and I think uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's about Kofi. And if I just ask that question, perhaps maybe that will help us solve the issue. You mentioned somebody called Fee? Yes. Bobby Gaffey, Fee, and Kofi. Do you recall his full name? In fact, that guy, the name I, I know was Fi. Till now, I don't know that. But when they say Fi, it means Kofi. Yeah. So is instead of them to say Kofi, they say Fi. Council, is that number 36 on the list? Just a moment, Mr. Chair. Ah. No. 36 is from Ivory Coast. Uh, there's a coffee there too. Adia coffee. Adia. Adia coffee that's from Ivory Coast. The okay. coffee he's talking about is from Ghana. It's from Ghana. Go ahead. Clarify. Yes. So uh, I don't have that coffee in any of the lists. Uh, but this is what I have discovered. Yeah. That we have a list of 51. Correct? We yes. have a list of 51. Yes, Council. And to that list, we should add, you said, Daniel Amankwa. Daniel. Robert Essien. Essien. Eric Yao. Nana Yao Ousu Ansa. That's all. Victor Oduru. Victor Oduru. Tarzan. Tarzan. Dennis Ohoni Kwachi. Sure. So if we add fee, that would give us one, two, three, four five, six, seven names to add. Okay. Right? That would give us um, 51 plus 7. 58. That would give us 58. 58. Right. Five, eight. And plus the nine Nigerians. That would give us a total of 67. We have received information that nine 
bodies were buried before the eight Ghanaians were discovered. And do we have the names of those nine Nigerians or not yet? No, not yet. Okay. Thank Fine. you very much, Mr. Uh, we will um, uh, issue a list, um, I hope, at the end of the day for really public information to clear any confusion. Thank you very much. Yeah, Mr. we'll do that. Again, uh, Mr. Chiri, thank you so much um, for coming to so uh, testify. As thank I was you. saying, to come and help us um, uh, fulfill our mandate to establish um, uh, a record of what really happened especially on this um, uh, item. Thank you, sir. Thank you again very much.